I want the Seahawks to be my first 10 season franchise ever. How to do that? 8,000 likes on this video will unlock another one in two days. 8,000 likes on that video. I will continue doing this. I really want a 10 season franchise. Guys, let's get it. I'm keeping this short and simple. Guys, I'm bringing back the Legion of Boom. I love the Seahawks. I love the city. I love the uniforms. I love the players. Tariq Wool and Devin Witherspoon, Kenneth Walker, DK Metcalf. We're going to go find a quarterback to become the franchise guy. Geno Smith is getting a little bit old. We don't have a ton of money to spend in free agency, but I promise you, this is gonna be the greatest franchise in channel history. I just know it. So buckle up and let's go. Seattle, huh? We ain't waiting till the next half. First play, big catch, make half. We gonna play, we don't care what you heard. Big run, Kenny Walker the third. We travel in thoughts, we don't travel by her. You beating us really sounding absurd. We hitting them hard, we keeping them rattled. You ain't know we go hard to see out. We got them confused, don't know what they doing. We got them shut down on that corner with wood. Ladies and gentlemen, boom, bam, fellas. I have been waiting to do this franchise for a very long time. The Legion. I'm bringing it back. Honestly, bub bam, look on the screen. The first things I want to say is Tariq Woolen and me did a video last year. Devin Witherspoon hit me up at one point saying he watched the vid. And then I also have a video with Kenneth Walker. These are some of my favorite players in the entire league. The Seahawks at their peak, growing up, my dad was always a Seahawks fan. A lot of people where I'm from in Canada are Seahawks fans. I've been to probably more Seahawks games than any other team. They are my favorite team in the NFC, um, them in Atlanta. And when they were at their peak, there was nothing better than watching the Seahawks. And I want to bring that back. This franchise, it means something to me. I love their uniforms. I love their stadium. It is so heavily requested. I want this to be 10 seasons and I want to make this the greatest franchise ever. Bob bam look on the screen. We got lots to talk about. We're going to introduce the lineup. We're going to talk about their draft pick. Guys, I'm just pumped, dude. I am so unbelievably excited for this. Words just don't quite, I don't know. I'm just, I'm, so, I'm stoked. See, my voice just cracked. Um, where do I even begin? I know you guys love this screen, so we're gonna talk on this screen. We're gonna go through everything, um, kind of position by position, just so we can kind of see. We'll talk about the draft, which I'm gonna jump in and kind of discuss right now, because the elephant in the room is, the quarterback situation is in a bit of a spot, um, which we gotta figure out. We have some re-signed stuff that we kind of need to talk about as well. We have pick number 16 in the draft. We have two thirds. We do not have a second round pick. So if we were to go QB that first pick, so let's, before we get into anything else, let's talk about the draft because obviously that's gonna be the first thing that's coming up, the quarterback situation. We pick at pick number 16. Sam Hartman, that's the mess up in the draft class. There's a few, oh my gosh, this draft class is actually super weird. Um, there, all the names are all messed up, but you can still kind of see, get the same idea. Um, Caleb Williams, Drake May, Jaden Daniels, Michael Penix, Bo Nix. These are the quarterbacks, Travis, Spencer Rattler, Joe Milton, John Rice, Plumsley, Plumley ran really fast. Curtis Rourke um, is the brother, I believe, of Nathan Rourke. I want to double check that one. Curtis Rourke. It's, he's Canadian, which is just so freaking cool. Um, but there's other things that we got to talk about. We pick at pick number 16. But in order to fully give you guys the entire like story, we got to talk about this cap space players that we don't have any way to afford going into this season we are incredibly broke um it's the elephant in the room it's the tough thing to talk about to start a franchise but i have six million in cap space i can't bring back jordan brooks i can't bring back devin bush it might change when we sim to resign noah fant is a difficult one i want to try and find a way to bring him back but I'm not so certain that I can. Damian Lewis is another one that I would love to bring back. Same with Leonard Williams. Um, but it's just hard to say if that is going to be in the cards um, as we go. I'm gonna wait, once we get to resign, I'm gonna talk, like take you guys through um, the roster and stuff in a little bit more detail. So now that we're actually in resign, you can see that we have a realistic $23 million in cap space. Which leads to the first decision that I want to make. I want to offer on Noah Fan. He seems to have interest in being here. I really like him. So I'm willing to even just be a little bit aggressive at 7 million and Noah Fan is going to be coming back. Other than that, all of these guys, I don't have the money to like have them still on the team. And I know we have some like money and stuff, people that we got to pay coming up in the future. So all of them are going to be going to free agency. 
Let's go do our official roster breakdown. Now this one, I know you guys like the lineup screen. Oh, do I do the lineup screen? Comment if you love the lineup screen, I'll use the lineup screen. I'm just not used to, I'm an old head. I'm like, I'm so used to going to this, but let's go to the adjust lineup screen. We're gonna go through every single position on the field and talk about things. Geno Smith um, is, I was at like West Virginia. This is what makes me feel old. I remember when I was like watching him, West Virginia, him and Tavon Austin, the Tavon Austin highlights. I don't know if any of you guys remember that. Um, Geno Smith, 11 year vet, 36,000 XP bar. This is why Madden isn't forgiving to these type of players. 31 million that he's owed over the next two years. Luckily it is only two years. At the core though, if, you're, if you've ever played Madden, I could win MVP with him. I could throw for a million yards. He will never get any better. And that's the sad thing. I love Gino. I'm a fan of him. I love the comeback that he's had. He deserved all that money. Franchise-wise, Madden-wise, I can't probably, I can't play him. I'm just telling you guys that right now. There's no reason to have him as my quarterback. Drew Locke, who I always get told is my NFL player lookalike. Six foot four, 228 pounds, 64 overall. He's 27 years old. So you look at him too, and you're probably thinking the exact same thing. What the heck are we gonna do with Drew Locke? Now, not to say that Drew Locke's a bad quarterback, but is he the future? If he was five years younger, he might be, but he's already 27 years old. Five year vet, 64 overall. Big X on the screen. Zzz, I can't play him. As much as I love him, I'd love to make Drew Locke a Super Bowl champion. It just can't happen, which leads to the thing. We kind of need a quarterback which we'll talk about in a second. Kenneth Walker here, one of my favorite people I've ever done a video with. I'm gonna link the videos below um, to the games I played against Seahawks. The cool thing about Kenneth Walker that I was like, this, he like loves, um, I think it's photography is one of his favorite hobbies. He plays, man, he's one of like the coolest people. Um, one of the people that you get a chance to talk to and you're immediately a fan. I watch a lot of the Seahawks games with my dad, so I get to see the Seahawks play just about the exact same as the Titans. He's such a beast in this game. I want to make him the greatest running back in the league. 94 speed, 94 excel, 90 change of direction. I don't have to say anything else. And he's already a superstar dev. Guys, Kenneth Walker Jr. Or Kenneth, Wa Kenneth Walker III, my bad. Um, he's going to carry us. Running back wise, we shouldn't have much to worry about, um, which is good. I won't be using my first. And But you also have Charbonnet, my favorite name in the entire league, Zach Charbonnet. Okay, let's talk receivers. Don't even look. It's DK. Honestly, the way I play, you guys know all I care about is speed and height. Well, dare I say more. DK, punch him in the face. I don't care about anything Metcalf. 96 speed, 95 acceleration, 87 deep route, deep route running. If you like drafted him, people would say it was a glitch. That's how good DK Metcalf is. He gets all these good abilities. He's an absolute stud. Having DK on your team, you have a red zone threat. He's only 86 overall because his stats, I believe, have diminished a little bit. Um, well, actually, I'll see myself out. 1,000 yards and 1,000 yards, which I'm surprised that he's only an 86 overall with that production. Um, this 13, he's had, wow, he's had an amazing career. Shout out to DK Metcalf. But he's obviously going to be our wide receiver one. Uh, Bobo, who, comment down below if you guys know where he is from. He is from another franchise this year. Tyler... Lock it. Um, probably if you go back years, he's a TD Barrett franchise legend. I used to trade for him in every single franchise, no joke. Back when he was 93 speed, I would trade for him every single time because he was like so underrated that he wasn't a big enough, like people weren't like, oh, I want Tyler Lockett. So I could usually get him for like a third round pick. And I like, absolutely, I'm just a big fan of Tyler Lockett. He is getting old. Um, 37,000 XP bar, he is what he is. You probably want to find a way to replace that as you go. Now, JSN, um, now, oh, stud. Six foot one, 22 years old, 89 speed, 90 acceleration. Now, if you were looking at him just as a pure kind of Madden player, you wouldn't really see anything that crazy, but I've used him, I've had him in franchises, and I'm a big fan of him. My goal is to try and make him a superstar, have kind of a duo with DK and him working together. Um, and I think it's doable. They used obviously a really early pick on JSN. Um, he's cheap, his, he's not expensive. He was the 20th overall pick. You won't see me draft a receiver this year. I think with Lockett at least has one or two more years left. DK and JSN were good. Cross, stud, 
23 years old, two years left, absolute beast of a tackle. He's going to want probably when that contract ends, he's going to be a $20 million guy. But until that day, I am very, very happy to have him. Um, Abraham Lucas, 25 years old, um, two year experience. He has 9,000 XP. Um, yeah, you can see two years, 1.74 per, and he appears to be outperforming. Like he was a third round pick. I think he could be our long-term answer. Like I think both tackles are very, very, very good. So that's something that I'm excited about. Noah Fant, I made a priority to pay because tight ends, especially with the speed that he has, are difficult to find. 75 vertical threat, 88 speed, 89 acceleration. Obviously they got him in the trade, the Russell Wilson trade. I think he's a beast. I'm happy to have him on the team. Let's switch over to the defense because the defense is the one that I am, where do we begin? Devin Witherspoon, what a rookie season this guy had. Like seriously, like can't get over it. Number five overall pick, um, three TFLs, like what was his career stats? He had, I think he had more than one pick. It's hard to say if the game can always like accurately. I don't remember, I just know that he was, when I would watch him, you would notice him on the field. 84 speed, needs a dev game and he could become an absolute stud. Tariq Woolen, maybe the best Madden DB I've ever seen in my entire life. Like seriously, 98 speed, 96 acceleration, 88 zone coverage. You just, this doesn't just happen. He's six foot four with that, with 98 speed. Like what? That is if they have him and DK who are both, they have the two best size speed kind of combo players in the entire league. Now, as a third receiver, you got, I believe his name is Trey Brown, three-year guy out of Oklahoma, 92 speed. He's definitely a capable third DB. But as you guys know, my goal is to try and recreate the Legion. Oh my, see, this is why I don't like the lineup screen. Now I'm getting, okay, I'm, I'm switching. I hope you guys enjoyed the lineup screen. While it was there, I had fun. It was good. It was a memory that we all have together of me kind of going through the lineup screen, but that memory's done. I can't, I can't be on the lineup screen anymore. Um, Trey Brown, Mike Jackson, these guys are all just kind of what they are. Calvin Joseph though, I want to give him another, a career resurgence. You guys, Cowboys fans, I was always like curious to know because he was drafted, I believe, yeah, he was a second round pick, really good speed. Don't be shocked, especially age-wise, if I have him as our third DB, just to start, because potential, he's definitely up there. Um, Quandre, this is the position that I would say we're a little bit, if you were to give like a grade of like our safeties, user-wise, I think they're very, very good. But long-term, Quandre is getting older. Um, Jamal Adams is getting older, but I'm a big fan of him. I don't know how long he's signed. And then Julian Love is a stud. I really, really, really like Julian Love. He's one that I want to make a superstar. He's so underrated and he's only 26 years old. Get him picks. He's gonna be a day one on the field starter. Jonathan Sutherland, also from a franchise that you guys have to remember. So guys, that's our team. We have pick number 16 in the draft. We have no money to spend in free agency. So don't expect me to be able like, to go out there and do anything crazy or bring in anything crazy in this first free agency because truthfully, I can't. I don't have that option. It's not something that we can do. Quarterback wise, let's just, we may as well talk because I don't, what would I do to trade up? The thing is, I don't have a second round pick. I don't have any assets that I would be really willing to get rid of. So it's like, it's kind of, you got Williams, May, and Daniels, and then there's a bit of a drop. I don't know, like, I feel like all of these guys could be seen in the second or the third round. So it's like, do I go quarterback or do I continue like trying to build the Legion, which I talked about is something really important to me, like a James Williams or one of these guys. Do I go to try and build the greatest secondary ever? Nate, Wigg Nate Wiggins just ran an insane 40. Um, there's Cooper DeJean, there's a ton of studs. There's Dallas Turner. There's also, you could argue, I kind of skipped over our linebackers. Whoa, party foul, Brett. Oh my gosh. I need, to, I need to figure it out. I skipped over the linebackers completely. Okay. Let's talk linebackers. Um, Leonard Williams, 31. Not a ton to discuss here. Mike Morris, young, but like these guys aren't gonna be here in two years. They're not gonna dev up. Defensive tackle wise, like if you were looking for like, okay, maybe there's a position that we need help with. 
But Boya Mafe is a stud. 87 speed, 91 acceleration. Big fan of him. I've had him. I want to make him a beast. His XP bar is not bad whatsoever. Derek Hall, I believe they drafted last year, I think, with like maybe I third, second, second round pick. They obviously invested in a pass rusher last year. Uh, Bobby Wagner in the middle. And then Nuosu um, had an excellent season. He's good. Six foot two. Like if I didn't go and draft one, like if I didn't go and draft an outside pass rush, we would be totally fine. Daryl Taylor as well. Levi Bell. Oh my gosh. He's also from the franchise that we got. This is like the greatest crossover since Endgame. If you remember the zero overall league, you'll remember all these faces. Okay. Now that we've talked about that, we're going to go to free agency. <sighs> Guys, this is, I am... I'm nerding out. I'm so excited. Okay, it's worth calling. The Bears are trading pick number one. It's worth at least... Yo, yo. Hello, sir. What's up, bro? What are you doing with the number one pick, dude? I'm not gonna lie, I'm tempted to take Marvin, but like Caleb's just sitting there, so... Are you gonna... Are you trading fields, or what's the deal? I'm not gonna lie, I might, I might trade fields, take Marvin, and then take me. You would trade Fields, take Marvin, and then take me. Okay, what's the what's the offer or what what's the price? I I got players. I got future. Are you looking for a lot of future picks or like what's the? Oh, he, so he offered me inside stuff, uh, Cam Hayward, and a first, and uh, Jalen Warren. And what so what picks what picks does he have? Twenty. So you'd get pick twenty and that stuff. Yeah. Yeah. He offered you all that for Justin Fields, pick 20, Hayward, and the other thing? Yeah. But, like, Hayward's 35, so, like, you know. Is there anything on my team that you see that you'd be like, I'd move Fields for? DK Metcalf. Well, D anything, <laughs> anything other? He's going to, I'm not going to have anyone to throw to. Terry Bowler. Yeah, see, that's the thing. I got, I can't do it. <laughs> So, okay, your other offer is you're getting an inside stuff, a good player, and pick 20? Yeah. Yeah, I can't remember that. Yeah, there's just no one on your team there. Yeah, I know. Okay, well, we're hey, I had to reach out because Fields, Fields would look good in a Seattle uniform. Don't lie. You know he would. I think he would look great in a Steelers uniform. Yeah, or you know what? Why don't you just keep Fields? And draft Marv, and then you have Fields and Marvin Harrison. That's what I would do if do I were you. What do? What? <laughs> like, why are you trading Fields? Do you not want Steelers to get Fields? I'm saying, why would you trade Fields? Just as like some friendly <laughs> advice. I feel like keep Fields. He's a stud. Draft Marvin Harrison Jr. Even what if you yeah. traded back three spots? Reach out to like the guy with the fourth pick. Try and get him to move up to one. Get something. I don't know. I'm not going to help you anymore, but pleasure. Good talk. All right. Good talk, Brett. Good talk. Okay. So we can't get, like, that's the only quarterback that we could, like, oh, we got this quarterback. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. It's the only quarterback that we can get. A lot of these free agents, people, if they didn't sign, will be going back to them. Like, Josh Allen's going back. Josh Jacobs is going back. Amari Cooper's. Anyone, like, really good is going back to their original teams. I'm telling you that already. We don't really have a choice to look at a lot of these free agents, um, and I don't have a, much money to be able to actually like make offers or do anything too crazy here. Um, the only free agents that I would try and get would be like someone like um, Johnson, just for a user. He's only 25 years old, and like even that, you can see now I have 12.5 million dollars. Like we're we're broke. I like Kyle Duggar. Nobody else seems to, but it, just because of his age, he won't progress as well as he should. Um, Gidry, Claybook, James Pierre, Tony Brown. I'm saving my money. I don't I don't need to go crazy for any of these free agents. So we'll see you guys um, when we see. Well, actually, we'll see how let's oh, let's do a deep dive into this. Quarterback wise. Who the heck? Like, it's so hard to do I try and trade up to 10? Like, let's say I get to pick number 10 and Jaden Daniels is sitting there. Do I trade? But like, what can I offer? I don't have a second. I don't want to get rid of anybody. So it's like, I have to pick at 16. Oh, what would you got? Like, what would the Seahawks? I don't see the Seahawks trying to move up. Caleb and May are gone. The only one that has a chance to still be there would be Jaden Daniels. But like also, oh, 
that's it's tough it's really tough okay we'll see you guys when we see you i don't know i don't know okay yo so the bears took my advice what the heck is life the bears literally took my advice and didn't trade with them oh my gosh so Marvin Harrison Jr. went number one overall. Okay, we'll see you guys in a couple picks here. Okay, Coolard McKinstry. So the quarterback that's still there is Jaden Daniels. Um, it's just whether or not he gets there. I've, I've reached out to these guys about trading up. I actually don't like, okay, if we're counting the teams, the Giants, yeah, they could take a quarterback. Atlanta could take a quarterback like I'd have to pretty much trade for this pick which would probably cost me my third Future picks and but I can try I just don't know This is interesting Okay, we're getting to the point where this could happen who's the Jets I could definitely Malik neighbors goes The bear I still have the Bears number took Marv now what what is the Bears doing what is the Bears doing what I'm literally gonna call the dude right now I thought he was he kept fields now he's probably gonna trade fields dude you took Daniels yeah. Why would you take Daniels and keep Fields? I had no quarterback. Who did you you traded Fields? Yeah. For pick twenty. Oh, you didn't get rid of the first. Okay, bet. Never mind. He he didn't trade his number one overall. For, oh my gosh. Oh he he. Tra Never mind. Okay. Oh my gosh. I'm a mess. I'm a mess. I'm a mess. I'm a mess. Okay. Nate Wiggins just ran an insane time. Six foot two. He ran an insane time, and that's updated. So if Nate Wiggins, oh my gosh, my head hurts. If Nate Wiggins is there, I would definitely take the Clemson kid. He just ran the best 40 time. And I know the commish tried to update to the combine because the combine is going on today. I would consider taking a Nate Wiggins if he is here. I told you guys, at pick 16, the QBs are gone. We're down, like, look at this. Everybody needs quarterbacks. Like, how? I don't even know what to think anymore. My head hurts. Oh my gosh. I could take James, but I, I just took James Wiggins. Bullard goes there. Okay, I... Wiggins just ran the best 40. I am crossing my fingers that speeds were updated because he ran, I believe he ran like a 4-2-4 or something. Nate Wiggins, what was his 40 time? 428 at six foot two. He could be another woolen. Guys, I'm I told you I'm trying to rebuild the Legion. He's got elite speed. Nate Wiggins. Boom! Let's go, baby! 428 40. Oh my gosh! 97 speed, 93 acceleration. Shout out to Isaac. Um, he updated all the different stuff after the combine as we go. There's a lot of people who work on these leagues. Shout out to you. 6185 speed 428 is disgusting. Oh my gosh, we're building it, dude. I'm building the best secondary on the planet. All the quarterbacks were gone. I don't even have a second round pick. Like, I'm cooked. I have no second round pick, but I have an insane. Secondary six foot two, 185, hidden dev, B man coverage out of Clemson, just an absolute super stud. James Williams, I drafted in a previous league, so I wasn't about to take James Williams. Could not be happier with a pick than I am with that one. Six two, 185, 21 years old. We get our guy. I did I didn't really go and expect that to be our guy. I thought we might have a chance at Daniels, but we got a secondary. Like I'm rebuilding this secondary and making it disgusting. One step at a time, one pick at a time. Punch him in the face, Nate Wiggins. Let's get it. Okay, so I'm gonna start talking right around here. Um, because the quarterback situation, like 
The only like, there's some cool ones. John Rye's Plums, Plumley around a four, four, seven. Um, Rourke, as you guys know, is a Canadian. That would be, but Joe Milton's a stud. He's got great throw power out of Tennessee. I could see him kind of becoming a beast. For us, six foot five, decent 40 elite arm power or elite arm strength. But all these guys are gonna be there, so you won't see me in this pick draft. That's the thing, if you if you don't get a quarterback early, there really isn't a point um, to completely go after it because at the end of the day, like it, it's really, really, really difficult to explain, but I can just promise you that it won't really have, like all those guys will be there because most of the teams who wanted quarterbacks have already taken their quarterbacks. Um, it, it, the draft is, it's thin right now. This is, this is thin. Blake Corum, if I didn't, oh, Braylon Allen's there. Love Braylon Allen. Um, Billy Bowman, A hit power and a 4-3-5 at safety. If he's there, I told you guys my number one priority is this and I'll see myself out. Okay. I have no sweet clue who to pick. We'll see who's here. Okay, so Jalen Harrell. 6'4", six, 4'6", four, four, six. he doesn't look horrible. Um, Barrett Carter, we know, is a stud. <sighs> Left end, right end, there's not a lot going on there. Doorless. This might be an O-line pick. Hmm, okay, who's best available? Barron's the best available of everybody. He's the best player on the board at a position that I wouldn't mind getting help at. I, I'm pretty good at safety, but I'm gonna need more. What did he run? I'm, I'm always down to just take the, I usually like to just take the best available. 449, great speed. He's probably decently quick. I'm gonna take the kid from USC. 91 speed, boom, let's go. That might be my user. 85 change of direction, 511 out of Texas. We go back to back. Defensive picks, I'm happy with that. I got no issue with that selection. 91 speed, 92 acceleration. Um, he was the best player on the board and I decided to make that pick really simple. Okay, so we're back up again. Oh, we're back up again. Gabriel Murphy out of UCLA, Graham Barton here. Um, there's a really, our guard situation does suck. Like we did just lose our guard. Um, See awareness for Jurgens. Like this is definitely a position that you could say we're bad at right now. A impact. I'm just looking for anyone who isn't like A impact, A pass block. What's his awareness B? Okay, I'm going, I'm gonna get a new guard to replace Damian Wilson. I think this is a good pick in the third round at a position of major need. 90 strength, super slow, but his awareness was pretty good. His pass block was really good. His finesse was really good. I feel like, he, look, A lead block, A pass block, B finesse, A run block. We have we needed to replace that position. We're really bad in the interior of our offensive line. And if your O-line sucks, you suck. And I'll say that a million times. If your O-line sucks, you suck. Um, I'm happy with that pick. Okay, fourth round. We're gonna have some... That's This is kind of where I'm thinking. Like We kind of got to start looking at quarterbacks because some of them are gonna start going. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is where... I think it's time. Okay. Oh, I only have 35 seconds left. Oh my gosh. I, I know who I want to take. Uh, it's 100%. He's, he's Canadian. Being someone who was a Canadian quarterback, I want to I want a season with Curtis Rourke. Growing up in Canada, playing this position, there's not a lot of guys who get this far. And I really look up to these guys. 6'5", 231. <clears throat> At least for this season, Captain Canada, this matters to me. Boom, let's go, Curtis. 80 speed, 81 acceleration, 95 throw power from Ohio, born in Oakville, Ontario. Honestly, guys, growing up as a, I've talked about the sport before, growing up as a Canadian quarterback, you never really see the NFL as a potential. You never even really <clears throat> look at D1 as potential. And now it starts happening, and to me, that's like the coolest thing ever. And all these guys, like him, Obviously, Nathan Rourke, like I just know there's going to be like kids who grow up in Canada now who are going to be like, man, I can I can really do it. So that's why also because he's a stud, 
That is why he's going to be my QB. 6'5", 231. I told you guys we weren't going to get one of the top tier guys. I don't expect him to be crazy high overall, but for this season, he's a gunslinger. I got good receivers, and I think the rest of our team is going to be insane. Guys, Curtis Rourke. Okay, so we, we do have a fifth round pick. This is kind of a fun pick. Whenever you have a chance to make a fun pick, your fun pick in the fifth round needs to be someone someone fast. Lawrence Keys the third out of two lane. Four four for Presley. D Wiggins. What's what is Lawrence Keys the third? Speed good. Uh, I don't know that. Not, let's be real. None of those guys playing. None of those guys are playing a single snap on this team. So I don't think there's any point. Um, is there any middle linebacker is usually sought after? I don't know who to take, dude. I really don't. Riley Mills. How to Nor no he's got B. Finesse moves. He might be like a good power rusher. Jaden. Jeremy Cole. Honestly, I feel like defensive tackle isn't a bad one to, to get at this spot. Chris Jenkins, A awareness, A block shedding. Okay, and the fastest, I'll take Chris Jenkins. 75 speed, boom! Okay, let's see how we did in the draft. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, boom! Let's go Wiggins! Love that pick. Honestly, shout out to, uh, we did good on these last picks too. Um, Nate Wiggins, did I go into this expecting to take a DB? Absolutely not, but the guy just ran in the 4-2. You pair him up with Woolen and you laugh. Honestly, the Legion, that's all I'm about. I want to create the best defense in the league. Baron was an interesting pick. Um, he's not a superstar or anything. He's not even star, but he's 91 speed and he's decent. Like, I think this was a solid pick given what was available at the spot. Zint, or, Zinter is going to be an instant starter out of Michigan. Uh, and then Rourke. Let's talk our quarterback situation because Curtis, ugh, Curtis is... Mm, the tools though are there. 95 throw power, 80 speed, 81 acceleration. I don't know, man. I know there's gonna be a lot of people who are like, why didn't you try and trade up? I couldn't, I did. I promise you, I did everything I could to trade up, to try and get into a spot, to get one of those top tier guys. I just couldn't. I didn't have money to sign any of the top guys in free agency because they all want a ridiculous amount of money. I didn't know what to do. I gotta, I gotta either go with Rourke, and then as the draft went on, all the, it was a tough spot. I don't know. I feel like I can make him good though, but I was hoping he could be a little bit better than that. Okay, so I decided, I, I switched everybody to try and make sure they looked. Um, Rourke doesn't actually have a beard. We cut Drew Locke because he need, he wanted like $6 million to stay. Um, oh, this is where, this is a tough decision. I just, the upside is way better. Like, I can't come on here and start Gino. And no matter how good of a year I have, I promise nothing is going to matter. I didn't take a receiver for a reason because I still have Lockett who's a stud and I have JSN and DK um, and a ton of like depth here. We have a hundred receivers on this team. DB, we now have Woolen, Witherspoon, and Nate Wiggins. That's a stud trio. The fact that we got Wiggins here, 6-2, is insane. Uh, and then safety, I help out a little bit. We have Julian Love and Adams, but I grab a user in Baron, well, maybe I'll make actually one of these guys my users because of that, but safety just got a lot better as well. We're gonna practice mode before week number one. I'm gonna give him the snaps for preseason. I'm gonna make him a focus player. And at least before the season start, actually, I'll, I'll keep these three. Those are my focus players right now. I wanna win with defense on this team, but I wanna see kind of where, how good he is. I like his throw power a lot. I like his size a lot, like he's a big quarterback, so we'll see in week number one. I'll make the call. Okay, we have wide receiver mentorship. Um, did you see JSN out there this week starting to call him Tyler Jr. because they're doing the same clock? This is year two for him. It's time to elevate. It's time to figure out a way to make him good. I'm gonna go, um, I actually meant to go deep route running, but I just was clicking the ball. The button, why did I just clicking the ball way too fast? Brad, come on. Um, Training camp standout, we have, who is this going to be? Devin Witherspoon. Let's go man coverage. I plan on playing a lot of man with this team. Plus five he gets? That's insane. I think he might actually get 
with he with plus five there i think he might actually get like some type of thing before the season um if he can get like sacks different stuff but we'll we'll find that out when we get there okay season goal honestly i didn't enter this thing to just show up i want to win super bowls i i really 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 do i want this team to become unstoppable i want to have the best defense in the league like all these things i i know i can rely on the run game i know rourke can be a beast um devin witherspoon two combined interceptions or deflections to continue. So he's got a chance to break out right off the bat as an 84 speed, 21 year old. We draft Nate Wiggins to join that secondary. And that is arguably the best secondary I've ever had or will have. When you get a 428 DB um, with your first round pick. Like I said, I could have went James Williams. I already had James Williams. If it wasn't for that, I probably would have taken him again, but it is what it is. Upgrades, let's, I wanna see Rourke play, you know? Like there's always next, like we could try and leverage something next year. If it goes horrible or if it's going bad as the year goes on, we can always try and figure things out. But like, personally, there was a huge quarterback drop off. And even if Bo Nix would have been there in the first round, I think I would have taken a chance on one of those guys. I just like, I couldn't because they weren't there. I didn't have like, Pick 16, you'd think you'd have a chance to be in the in the dance. I tried to trade for Justin Fields. I did everything I can to avoid this situation, but I really just couldn't. Um, at least for practice mode, Curtis Rourke, I'm gonna make him our starter. Kenneth Walker, receivers, I don't have to talk a lot. You guys know it's gonna be JSN, Metcalf, Noah Fant we bring back. Left guard, we got Anthony Bradford. Um, and then at right guard, we got the new rookie. Um, and I can figure out, yeah, see, I needed that really bad. Left end, I didn't feel the need to go crazy at this position because we do have these really solid outside linebackers um, in Derek Hall and Boya Mafe. They're kind of the two that I'm most excited about. Nwosu, I think, is really good, but I just don't know if I see the like crazy future potential because his overall is low. Um, but Derek Hall is really young, and so is Boya Mafe. I could see both of those guys, like becoming insanely talented on this team. Um, oh my gosh. I can't sub anybody out here. This is the most frustrating thing in the world. I just can't sub anything. There we go. Uh, I'm trying to do this depth chart. So Derek Hall is gonna play there. And then on this side, it's gonna be Boya Mafe. DBU, baby. Um, Witherspoon, Nate Wiggins, and Calvin Josephs. That, that's a second. We just did great. Um, up top, this is where I want to put Julian Love there and Adams there. And then have the other guys, my user. Slot receiver for now, I'm gonna put DK because he's kind of gotta be my number one. Sub linebacker, meaning our user. Um, what's the change of direction on this guy? Impact, change of direction. Um, I don't know what it is. Jarek Reed's a good one. And then Barron's probably gonna be my user until something tells me to not make him my user. And then Nate Wiggins, I'll put Witherspoon in the slot because that's where he plays with Calvin Joseph helping him. Okay, let's go to practice mode. I just wanna see how Curtis looks. Okay, let's just see what do we got here in Rourke. Dude, he's a big, like, as far as frame, six foot five is a legit, like, 80 speed is fine. Like, I'm not seeing anything. Here. I'm, I'm clearly just running plays. But this this isn't bad to me. Like, okay. Maybe I need to look in the mirror a little bit. If it goes really bad, we could trade some assets to try and get someone's backup. Or like, look. But I think for now, I need to at least begin this season with him. Good size. Decent speed, great throw power. Like, okay, you know what? I don't care. It's Rourke. Kenneth Walker can carry us. DK can carry us. He, they they can make any quarterback a stud. Even though Madden wise, he doesn't have great ratings. I'm, it's go time. Best secondary in the league, I think. Show up. Let's go, guys. Oh my gosh, the Curtis Rourke experience is officially here. Go. Oh my gosh, Kenneth Walker can carry anybody. 
Like, give that guy the ball. His juke moves, his stiff arms, everything, his change of direction, they're all insane. Every single stat that you look for in a running back, Kenneth Walker has all of them. And, like, Metcalf, JSN, all of these things together, that this could be interesting. Look at this. Look at this. Go! Get out there, Walker! It's two for 15. Well done, sir. Okay, first true pass. Oh. And that'll be off the mark too far out in front, and it's incomplete. Okay. That one, that was offline. I'll, I'll admit that was super, super, super offline. Over the middle of the field. Ah, okay, that's all right. It was open, too. JSN ran a perfect route. That was definitely open. Looking to throw. Oh gosh, yeah, he's all over the place right now. He's all over the place. That's that's too blatant, Mister. Like blatant, like not even funny, Mister. Oh, okay, now I'm thinking. Okay. They're gonna try and throw. Now it's bad on me. Okay, well the two plays before that were totally off by like 10 yards, both of them. That's a little bit scary. I'm not scared, but that was, that was not good. That was not good at all. So, okay, relax. It is what it is. Let's just focus on the defense. Nate Wiggins is playing on the left side. Woolen, Devin Witherspoon in the middle. Get out of there, guys. That's all right. Second and six. It's going to be our run D that's going to struggle. And as I said, I'm, I'm using Baron because it's a new rookie. It's someone who I, if I could like have a good year with, if I could lurk some people with, if I could get some TFLs, I could potentially make him. Oh, he's quick too. Go. Go, Baron. Go, Baron. You're so good. Come on, man. The Legion, it's back. Don't at me, it's back. Don't talk to anybody, it's back. What did I say? Oh my goodness, what a lurk. Okay, back to the run, because Rourke, Rourke, that was absolutely horrendous, what just happened. That was horrendous. Hmm. He's just stacking the box, and he's gonna force me to throw the ball. He's gonna force me to beat him because he saw he saw what you guys saw first. There we go. Get the nerves out. Work. Just get the nerves out. Short, easy throws. Simplify everything. Just throw this bubble to lock it. Throw that bubble to lock it. Yeah. Get upfield, Tyler. That's all right. Going five wide because I know he's in man, and I might be able to get a matchup here that I like. Go, go, K9! Good job, Kenneth! Big time throw, four for eight. Okay, settle in. Settle in. That was much better. See, five wide, I don't have to worry about, like, he's got to try and find a way to defend all of that, and he didn't do a good job right there. First and ten. Off the play fake, he'll look to throw. He'll let this go deep for Smith and She missed him. Bro. Oh my gosh, he missed him clean too. That wasn't even just a miss, that was like a, that was a miss. So like, if we're being just honest right now, I would say there's been three plays that he has totally missed the receiver. That's a good throw though. That's a good throw and good catch from JSN, see? Okay. He's missing the receivers blatantly, and then he's making big plays. I feel like I'm going to get one-on-one -on -one here with Metcalf, depending on what that safety is doing. I see you. I see you. Oh. Wow. I'm sorry. Wow. Oh, my gosh. That was... Unbelievable. Now back to throw. They still can't get it. Let's dance, baby. Let's dance. 
first touchdown pass. That was, hey, you missed your first three throws. I was already trying to make trade offers for Baker Mayfield or something. And then he just makes like three unreal throws. And we're up sevens it beautiful. Good job, man. Good job. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh nice. Shoot, what's his speed? I, I consider drafting Cameron Ward. But I, I just had kind of what I don't remember I don't know what Cameron Ward's speed is. Second and ten, he'll look to throw again. This one goes out Great job by the second there. You can see he's not, he doesn't have a lot downfield right now. Like, if you look, there is very few passing lanes. If you've actually watched the plays, the man coverage is doing amazing. But if you're running the football, at least you know where everyone is coming from. No. Who got it? Pick it up! Pick it up, defense! Pick it up! Who forced that? I think that was Calvin Joseph. I'm pretty sure that was Calvin Joseph who just forced that. Great job, Calvin. Okay, let's... We can run once or twice here. Try and fool him. No. I thought based on that look, I was going to have a ton of yards right there, but I didn't. It's going to be man on man. Just make the read. Oh my gosh. Back in the other direction. He doesn't even, he can't even, his, his overall is so low, he can't even slide. That's like the number one, like, oh my gosh, your overall is low. If you can't slide in this game, that's like one of the basic needs. Love that shot, though. Wow. I... The arm strength, <laughs> the arm strength is there. I don't think anyone can deny the arm strength is there for sure. Okay, look for Lockett here. The veteran, the veteran, nice throw. That was on time and perfect. Twenty seconds here. That's that's the best throw yet. That was late. I needed time to make that throw. That was perfectly done. I have the field goal. I might just try and the most success in this league. Get out of bounds, make Great rope. Great rope by Jackson. This is Shoot. I thought for sure I had time I I was convinced I was gonna have time to get out of there. Okay, that's fine. It is what it is. Overall, a pretty good half of football. Okay, defense. I just need you guys to continue to go crazy. Allow no points and no stops. Allow no points, no field goals, no touchdowns, no nothing. That's that's the weak player right now. And it won't be forever because Joseph is going to figure it out. But as of right now, that is the weakest spot in the secondary um, is Joseph. Come on, Wiggins! Good tackle, Wiggins. Good tackle. Oh, that was a beautiful throw. He got Witherspoon on the end cut. Like, he just totally burnt him on the end cut there. We got a game. Their halftime lead now evaporated. We're back to level. Go, Kenneth. Yep. <sighs> Good fight. That safety just prevented what I thought was a for sure touchdown right there. He'll try again with the arm. Yep. DK. He'll find Metcalf. Have seen some good ones. We certainly have, partner. Have a Joe Bowman. You, you, go. Kenneth Walker, go. Score. You got to score on that. Yeah, you're not catching him. To the one. He's got seven for 77. 77 yards for him on the ground now as he has been terrific.
thing is, his offense has not been amazing. It hasn't been bad, but it's been far from amazing. Uh. He's stopping the run really good in the red zone. We're going to have to either take three or throw an absolute beam. He threw an absolute beam. Tyler, that's why you have a veteran receiver like Tyler Lockett on the outside. Runs up perfect zig route. 14 7. Okay, defense. One stop. One stop. Ah. Good play. Yo, this might come down to a Nathan Rourke money drive. Or a Curtis Rourke money drive. They'll look to throw here on first down. Joseph, it's been Joseph every single time. Here's third down now. Buying time to his left. And that is in As expected, they're going for it to keep the drive alive. Get over here, dude. And it's incomplete. They cannot convert. And they turn it over. That is clutch. That's Reed made that play. But honestly, everywhere else is boxed. Like there was not a lot of places to throw that football. And people are throwing the slot receivers, the running backs, to avoid the DBs that we have. One first down wins this thing. You know what? I think, I think I know what play. Nice hole for him. Ends up picking up nice yardage. Stays in bounds to keep the clock rolling. They are in charge. Curtis! Curtis! Picked up by the USC man, Adore Jack. Sometimes he Please bail me out. No way. That was there, too. That was there. Escaping the pressure right. The 20. Back to throw. It's got to be a fake. Got him. And he can't get a throw away. He's taken down. Good defense. We're gonna we're gonna look at some things. We're gonna talk about some things. I promise you, we're gonna talk about some things. Oof. Are we ever? Yeah, it's, it's just Joseph. He does. As I would too. No chance. Oh. Tackle! Tariq Wallen! Get me out of here. Get me out of here with the win. I don't care what it takes. Get me out of here with the win. Oh my gosh. The scramble thing. I thought I was a genius. I was like, oh, I'm scrambling out. Playmaker. It's out of bounds. Good game. Okay, one and oh. It's disgusting. It's not a win that I'm going to brag about. But it's we got some things that we got to think about. I would be lying if I said that Rourke was not an absolute dumpster fire in this game. I would be lying. Like, that was one of the worst performances I've ever had from a quarterback. Like ever. So, this game was won by our defense and our running back. He made one really crazy play, but he missed probably five throws in this game. Like, five clear inaccurates. Here, this one I can't really expect him to make. But, like, right here, I'm, I'm throwing this ball to that guy right there. Look at look at him. Look at where this ball ends up. Like just significantly overthrown. Um, I hope there's some at the beginning that I can show you some of the misses that he had. Because he did get better, but there were a lot of misses at the beginning. Shout out to Baron for the pick right off the bat. But everything got smoother as it went on. And I'm not ready to give up on him. But like this game, I don't know if it was a first game jitters virtually. But like that was horrible. 1-0 though, that's all I care about, GG's. Okay, so camp standout, we didn't get the interceptions with Witherspoon. Um, I'll start blitzing him more, it'll, it'll happen, it'll come. He's gonna be playing the slot, so I'll, I'm gonna be sending. I've thought about running a defense at a dollar where I put Woolen and those guys up top and I just scream and just have them play crazy coverage. Either way, good game. Okay, so I don't know, like, I'm not planning on switching it, but I do want to look through free agency just to see if any quarterbacks didn't get signed. If there's anyone that would be Malik Cunningham is actually on our team. Mariota, Franks, Matt, there's just, 
there's not a lot here. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna sugarcoat this. Like I'm stat wise, Rourke's better than all of those guys. We're gonna figure it out. Just give them a game. I know there's haters out there, but give them a game. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, week number two. Yeah, yikes, yikes. I don't know, man. Nate Wiggins, secondary was amazing. I wanna send Devin Witherspoon on the blitz more. Um, just to kind of see how that goes. The defense, we were forcing fumbles. We were big hits, great coverage, everything. Just like check, check, check. Check all the boxes of what you want in a game. That was it on the defensive side of the ball. Offensively, we were, it was at times, I don't know. It got me like looking at some teams with like, who's back, who's got backup quarterbacks that's shopping? Because if I can make this defense really good and I feel like it's just a quarterback away, I'm not opposed to trying to make a move. I'm not opposed to trying to go after and trade a, a first or a future first or a couple first to bring in somebody that I think could actually help us right now. I really wanted Justin Fields. I just didn't have the leverage to get him. Like Justin, that trade for Fields was absolutely, that guy ended up with Marvin Harrison Jr., another pick, and Jaden Daniels, which was crazy. Um, Noah Fan gets an upgrade as well. As you guys saw, I looked through all the like different stuff and I didn't see a whole lot when it comes to like um, quarterbacks available. There's Dorian, like, and we still have no money going into year two, by the way. Like this team has a bit of a money issue, but some of the quarterbacks that are always like intriguing, um, the Browns backup is always intriguing, but I'm curious. I feel like he's probably starting, but this guy is always interesting. He's 24 years old, but he's a lower overall than Rourke. Um, you got Dobbs, you got Leary. Like, these are some of the people that we can, if, if things get rough, like I know Sam Howell's not playing anymore. So it's like Sam Howell lost his job to Caleb Williams. What's Sam Howell doing, you know? Pick up the phone. Commanders, what, what do I gotta do? Like, th these are the sort of things that you could see us, but I just don't plan on it happening because I know Rourke's gonna figure it out. And he's wanna know what's a starter, even though he was our worst player. Week two, let's get it. They'll try and start this check down, check down, game. good check down. Right person to check down to. I thought I was gonna have maybe, it was zero. Realistically, I think, I actually think I may have had, I wanna take shots to DK Metcalf. He's in cover zero and I can just tell by the alignment. There's no safeties up top. There's no safeties. Go Rourke, good throw Rourke, shut him up. And my camera dies as soon as I throw a dot. Cover zero, you wanna get out of cover zero? I could tell just by alignment that that was linebacker blitz zero. All I needed was a second DK Metcalf, seven zip. Okay, everybody breathe. We're gonna be fine. Good defense, guys. Look at the secondary. It's, a, it's funny because you don't even really get to see it when you're like just here, but the secondary it's a it's a snuggie out there. Like people are not moving easily on us whatsoever right now. Rogers gonna throw. Let's get over here, dude. And he goes down. It's a sack. They get him back at his own three yard line. Mothe looks like a defensive tackle. Oh my gosh, this guy's going for it. On, this is where you get free interceptions. Rogers gonna go on fourth down. I don't know where you're going, boss. But this D-line is scary. Mafe, I think, has insane potential. I just, he is like, that, he's a beast. He is super good. Let's try and throw that to Walker. Hmm. I want to leave him here. But his run, like he's got eight linemen. I have to make a throw against it. That's the thing. I can't play scared and just run. I have to. Someone's gonna have to make a throw here. It's gonna have to be me. I might I think it's just me. Good dot. Simple. I said that it was man the previous plays. But the thing is, his defense, his goal line defense was much better than whatever that was. That was not good. Play action. Now it's Rogers. Look at his defense. Just man coverage. People don't move. Rogers to throw for it on four. And they hit him as he 
throws is this one's gonna go straight Beautiful. down to the dough. Get the football back in outstanding field. Caught him on his D line. Caught him on his D line. Just throw a laser, Brett. Oh my gosh. I'm just quick snapping. I'm coming out in these wild plays because I'm sick of running the same plays and I'm just quick snapping. 21 0. This is a start to the season. Oh my gosh. I love it. This has been a great game. Wiggins. Wiggins, you stud! Stop the disrespect. Stop it. This is a snuggie. This guy usually scores on me. Like. This guy usually puts up a lot of points on me, and he is absolutely boxed with this man coverage. Come out throwing here on first down. No. Oh, that is downfield. Equally good. That's Sauce Gardner. I wasn't. I was not about to test people that I don't test. One Number one. Sauce Gardner. I don't know if you guys saw, I had a crossing route going right across the middle of the field. Rather than throwing it at Sauce Gardner, I decided to do the exact opposite. Don't throw it at Sauce Gardner. That worked much better. I waited. I'd rather take a sack. I'm trying to learn from my mistakes. I've made a few. Get out of there, Kenneth. Good run, sir. That's cover zero. I'm running slot fade. Look at that throw and tell me! Tell me he's not good! Look at that throw. It was just nerves. First game nerves. That's all that was. First now, now they're gone. He's got no nerves anymore. 28 zip. That was a beam. Go Baron. Baron, yeah, got him. That's two for him. That's two for him. Win, let's win Defensive Rookie of the Year. Let's, let's do it. Let's win Defensive Rookie of the Year and win the entire thing. If it tells you how bad Colts was, I believe this guy actually beat me in Colts. Colts was... Colts... I don't... We don't talk about the Colts. Out of the gun. They'll look to throw. Flushed out right. He hits his target. Dude went from throwing ducks... To throwing beams. Good job. Holy, that was beautiful. Dot. That's crazy. That throw was even better than the last. I threw a bad ball. He missed it so perfectly that it went away from his user. I've thrown five touchdowns in this game. And this guy, who usually I have good... Look at this throw by Rourke. I normally have good games. He can't move against the man coverage at all. That's what we're going to find. The man coverage is going to just annoy people. They certainly know the hole that they face as they begin the second half. They have to do what precious few teams have done in NFL history. Let's try to come back from a four position. Got him again. And Rogers intercepted a <laughs> This defense is insane. Don't quit. Please don't quit. Please don't quit. Oh my gosh. Like you. I get quitting. Like, I'm putting myself in his shoes. I probably would have quit too, but, like, it just ruins an entire half of stats. Like, I was having an insane game. Yeah, you're in an absolute snuggie, uh, but that doesn't mean you got to quit. Rourke has five touchdown passes. And see, all these stats could have been so much better. Like, I'm happy with it. Barron has three picks in, like, two games. Um, Wiggins got a pick. My camera died again. Uh, we'll see you guys week three. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, <sighs> players ready to negotiate. No breakouts. Julian Love is expensive, but I love. I love him. I really do. No interest. Um, I'm going to start with kind of giving him the offer that, yeah, this is the reason why Quandre is not playing that much. Other than that, it's a pretty cheap offseason. It really is. There isn't anything crazy. Charles Cross, we got to accept the option. We have no money, but it's not like we really need a lot of money. Because a lot of the players that we want, a lot of our long-term guys are signed. So far, best performances. Rourke has had a couple really good games. Uh, my new user has been unreal. And if I can have him, like he's got three picks already. If I can win a major award, make him superstar, the future is bright. Um, Kenneth Walker Jr. has been amazing. Absolutely. So I'm not going to clap for every single player. But he's been awesome when I need him. He's juking everybody out. Good in the passing game. Um, 
Devin Witherspoon's really good. You don't notice these corners right now because that's that's how you know they're good is because you're not noticing them, but you're noticing that people aren't passing on us. And I believe we'll probably have the number one pass defense in the game. Barron goes up to a 72 overall, plus two man coverage. He is 23. I wish he was a little bit younger, uh, but he's still a beast. Okay, Vikings week. They're also 2-0. This guy's a tough out. Let's get it. This guy drafted Bo Nix. So Bo Nix, oh. Nix wasn't there in the first round. I, I thought that was one of the players that I was going to have to make a really difficult decision if he was there. It made the whole decision super easy for me when he wasn't. Um, because when he wasn't there, it was like no brainer. Like literally, I'm not taking a quarterback. There was no, there was no quarterbacks there whatsoever. Look at this coverage. Are you seeing what Woolen just did to that tight end? Just watch that back. Watch that back in slow mo. He's running the ropes. We got no picks with these guys because no one can throw the ball, and hopefully that means our line can start going crazy. That's that's optimal. Ah, uh, that's good. That's Jettas. That's a tough matchup. How does that? First four steps that was boxed. Get over here! That's Hall. Stud. Him and Boyamafe are both unreal. He plays in this defense. Um, Nuosu plays in the other one. I got both of them. I'm making sure they're both getting reps so I can kind of see who's better. But the coverage sacks we're getting right now are out of this world. I just got to watch. Jefferson's really my biggest concern. Uh, Nate Wiggins actually just got to play a little bit of that. He'll look to throw. Good job, boy. There you go. You can break out or you can break in. That makes it hard to defend. He's short. That's cool. They'll look to throw. Get over here. Good play. Now that's a spot up round. That's that's a 50-50 ball, but honestly, he got my user out of there. I was late getting to it. Power to him. Okay. Seven's it. Just run slants. They'll try and start this drive in the air. Seven slants. He's there. That was an no That was an no no That was honestly. They bought the house that time on a young rookie. Maybe a little rattled through the house. No, they're under pressure. I don't know if you see Metcalf right there wide open. It was, that was missed by no less than 15 yards. Okay, that's all right. That's all right. From the shotgun, he'll look to throw. That is caught. They're going to look to throw. There's Addison. Touchdown, Vikings. We're all right. We're going to switch it up. Um, this guy's playing really good. He is. And they're in an early hole. The first drive, they threw the interception. That led to a Good touchdown. Okay, so I want to make sure I don't do anything. Well, that ship's kind of sailed. But I, I want to run the ball and just try and ensure I don't do anything stupid. Because I kind of made a really, really, really big mistake on that first drive. That was totally unnecessary. That, that throw didn't need to be. It was a slant that was open. But the under pressure got there. And it. The ball totally fluttered. I don't even think it was necessarily Rourke's fault, but I want to try and make sure that I prevent that on this particular drive. Yeah, there it is. Easy. Go. Go. There it is. Yep. Question is here to you. Do you run a little bit of clock? I, I don't think so. The tricky thing is here, what do I want to do? Like, do I get any benefit from scoring quickly and getting him back on... Part of me wants to get him back on offense so that he can make a mistake. Part of me wants to just try my best to score with no time left so I can double score at the half and be in a much better position to win. Uh, good defense. Okay. So. 
Not in an ideal situation right here. I have to throw the ball. I think he's screaming. He is. You just got to make a read. You just got to make a crazy read. And that... Stay in it. Stay alive. Stay. It's not... You don't have to win in one play. You just stay alive. He blitzed everybody. I made a good read over the middle. Oh, 14-7. Do something stupid. Do something. Make a bad business. You're trying to be cool. You're trying to be cool and you made a bad business decision. You thought you thought it was sweet. That first drive, you started thinking it was sweet over here. It's not. Woolen gets his first pick. Let's go Woolen. See what I'm like? It's not always going to be crazy defense, but when it is, it's going to be insane. Like, nobody was moving. Jefferson totally boxed up right there. They'll set up to throw. Can't even slide. Does, does Madden really think that players, just because they're not a crazy, they, they don't all know how to slide? How is it that you have to be over a certain run? Like, that's the most wild thing. Like, everybody knows how to slide. It's the NFL. Yo, one left. Yo, I, got, I have a timeout left. They'll throw now on the final play. We're back, and we get ball at half. Don't quit on us yet. Couple bad drives, bad first throw, don't quit on us. Nice catch, Noah fan. That's why we paid him. That is why we paid him. Be elite. Don't, don't just play football, be elite. Okay, he stops. I do think... I do think situation I have to go for this um, and just hope that I get that same. If he gives me that man on man look, someone's just going to have to make a play. That's really the only way to put this. Someone's just going to have to go crazy. I'm honestly thinking JSN right in the middle of the field if it's, if it's one on one. Dot. Lock it. Never change, Tyler. Promise me you'll never change. Good play. Pocket like crazy. Pocket like crazy. Eight for 15, two touchdowns. Okay. We were put in a situation early where we we're going to have to pass a lot to win this game, and we've done it. We've done it super well. Good run, Walker. Just throw it. Trust him. Ah, uh, that's okay. See, at some point, I want Jackson Smith to be elite. Like, so I think when one-on-one -on -one situations, I like that from me. And I know I'm talking in third person, but like, I like the idea of just like throwing him the ball and being like, hey, make a crazy play for us. That, that's the best throw I've ever seen. That's the best throw I've ever seen. Rourke either makes the worst or the best, nothing in between. He's the best quarterback or the worst at any given time. That was un Oh my gosh. Uh, that is that was one of the better throws I've ever seen pass lead wise. Just hand this off. He's got everyone up close. JSN. Beautiful. He was playing that kind of 6-1 defense where I didn't think I'd be able to run. Made a business decision and paid off. 21-14. Now he'll look to throw here on second and ten. And he's got this to Jefferson. He's got room Please, to someone just down to the They'll drop to throw. The quick throw finds TJ Hawkinson. Touchdown. Uh, that wasn't that wasn't good. They'll look to throw here. Crazy. Crazy dude. Just don't fumble. He's got three timeouts. So he, with that throw, as good as that was, I would have been much better to sit at like the 20 because this almost this guarantees him a chance to get the ball back. Even if I get seven, he for sure, he has a hope. But it is what it is. Take seven. If he's gonna win going for two, he wins going for two. That means your guys going downfield to catch the ball, they 
Can't guard that. I don't know why I can't. Why I'm not. Yep, there we go. Now he's out of bounds. Get there. What a play by Adams. Good job, Adams. It may be a non-stop push to finish this drive off. Everyone better be on the same page nope. right now. Because I think they're going to try and get several plays off. Okay, minimum we're going to get a chance here. Now the Seahawks call the second of their three. He always does this. This is nothing new. He always plays really good offense. And I'm struggling against TJ and... They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. Steps away to his left. And he will be very close to a for the game. Down, He's got two timeouts. Yeah, this is for the game. But if I stop him, the problem is if I stop him, you don't understand. I, pro I can't take a near. It's a safety. This isn't as good of a spot as you might think. Safe and three. Okay, Curtis. Whoa. Let's go. 33 seconds, no timeouts. Okay, I'm looking JSN to Metcalf. Yeah, you just have to stay in the pocket. Yeah. Second earlier, I definitely. The problem is he's got, he's got two timeouts. This isn't lucrative for me anymore. This is actually a situation where I could, I could lose this game. I need just... I need a first down, but I also... I should have taken the sack. That was a Snuggie. You got a fun... Dang, I may have just lost this thing. I may have just lost this thing. There's going to be some frustration, but now he's got to make sure that that frustration is temporary, not lingering. Big throw coming up. That's a dot! That is a punt dot. Shut up. That was amazing. That's one of the greatest punts I've ever seen. That's why that's all I allow. I don't allow defense, just special teams. Hands it off out of the gun. And he'll be They'll look to throw now on first down. And the Seahawks defense gets to him. Well, we're going to OT. Couldn't get a stop, couldn't get off the field. We get what we deserve in OT. We won the toss. Okay, Kenneth Walker, can you just win this thing for us? The man on man has been killing us. The man on man has been a legitimate problem. He might onside this. No. Okay. Money drive, everybody. Well, they fought hard to reach this point, Charles, and now what an opportunity. They've got the ball for eye. We need a great drive, and this is what they've been planning for. It's time to execute and take it downfield, even against all these odds. Kenneth, you're a stud. Defense, we kind of suck. Offense, we kind of suck. Kenneth, let's go. Absolutely the go. When in doubt, get the ball to the kid. That game shouldn't have went down to the wire like that. It shouldn't have been that, that situation. But it was, and we clutched it. GG's. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, boom bam, fellas. We, we're, we're undefeated. Like, I'm going to praise. I'm going to praise Curtis Rourke. I think he's been awesome. Um, this is huge for Rourke. Have 300 passing yards this game. Now, I want to look at abilities. I want to look at focus players. I want to look at staff points. All these different kind of things as we go here. But I think all in all, the main thing that I want to say is just like, hey, this is going, this is going quite well. Um, the defense is playing amazing. The offense is playing amazing. We have the run game that we can kind of like look at when we're in trouble. The run game has been there. Which has been great. We get an upgrade for JSN. He's been solid, like especially running over the middle. I feel like he's been really good. Now, Rourke, this is the tough thing about him is, and like whether or not, I don't know how good I can make him, but at the end of the day, he's not upgrading crazy fast. And that's going to be a problem as we go. Like I need to figure out like, okay, I have four good years with this guy. Is he even going to make it to 85 overall? Like these are your million dollar questions, but at the end of the day, we're undefeated. Let's go. Bro, the Seahawks field, I can't see anything. I can't see my own shadow right now. 
This is, why is, like, the lighting, is it my eyes or is it the field that's, I can't see. Oh my goodness, I am in, I am a mess vision-wise right now. Holy doly, okay. Baron, go! It's Calvin Joseph's shot! Oh, the man-on-man -man defense of the center. Yeah, I can't even see, so thank you, Joseph, because... I can't see anything. Metcalf, perfect, perfect throw. At some point, I just gotta start leaving a little. Like, seriously, he can be the best player in the league. He already is one of the, like, I have to start leaning on him in these like pressure situations because he's gonna be the one to carry us. He really is. I would have done that again. I would do that same thing again. That's one on one coverage. Hit him in the hands. It's just an unlucky bounce, and James Williams got it. That's just truly an unlucky bounce. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Here's A Chan to start the drive. Now a play fake. Here's Tug of Iloa. Ah, he got me. Good throw. A run straight ahead with H -in. And he's up a Go. That's fourth. That's fourth. That's fourth. That's fourth. This is a team that matches up good with us from a speed perspective, though. Like, this team's got... And I can't see. So, like, that's, that's working against me. I can't see anything. Look at this. Look at the defense! Oh my gosh! It's man on man! It is the- this is the best defense I've ever had. Okay, Rourke, we need 300 today. And I'm not even just saying that, like, for the future of the team, the future of society, we need 300 yards. This catch, JSN? Where did go, Jackson? to throw now on first down. Yep. And he slides. He'll look to throw. One box. Fourth down. Okay, this is... The thing is, I'm trying to throw the 300 yards for the game day goal, but in doing that, things are horrible. In doing that, I am... Can't find anybody open right now at all. Yep, good job, fan. Way to just see that's way to beat your man. Good job, Noah. Way to go, Noah Fant. Back to throw again. That's a laser. Right over the middle. Perfectly thrown. Seven zip. Way to go. Okay. We got this. The mid company is so insane, and we're not getting picks, but it is just fast. We are really, really, really fast out here. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. Looking deep downfield. Well, that's insanity. That's why he's the best. Oh my gosh. Watch that back and tell me that he's not the best DB you've ever seen in your life. Wow. Woolen just... <sighs> Horrible punt. We might actually go house this. There we go. Just sit down, lock it. Nothing stupid to know. From the shotgun, he'll look to throw. Yeah, I might have to give up on the 300 yards. The goal was to get the 300 yards for the game day goal because I'm trying to... Out of the gun now on third down. They'll let this go deep for Smith and Jigba. Yeah, the goal, that was the game day goal. I think I got to... I think I got to give up on it. Let's just run the ball to Walker and make sure that we leave here with the win. I think that's as simple as I can put this. I might just throw this ball into the atmosphere. Oh, gosh. Okay, defense, bail me out again. Off a play action. Tug of Iloa. 
Gets this one to Hill. Here's Tonga by Loa on first and ten. Got him. <laughs> Calvin Jones. Shut up. He just got his second. So he imagine he goes up to start up and we just like we got the four best DBs in the league. Okay, Brett, all I need, like I'm not asking for the world for myself here, but like, can we move the ball like even just a little bit? It doesn't have to be anything crazy, but even just like three points here would go a long way momentum wise. Because right now I feel like we we're horrible. Oh, or do they play coverage on this down? Going for Metcalf on the deep ball. And that will be that was great. That, that was a great throw. A I stand by that being a great throw. The air, never gave up, converged on his man, and broke the That was excellent. Pick it up! Pick it up! Pick it up! Pick it up! Time for a break. We've hit half time. Pick it up! What was going on? This is the NFL. He touched it. Did he he touched the ball? And we welcome you back live. That's a touch what? Why did the play that's gotta be the play just stop? Did he not touch that ball? Like if I would have grabbed that, that's seven points. Am I losing my mind? Fielded just outside the goal line. Oh, I'm sorry if I'm just com complaining, but I promise you, I think that should have been seven. We have not seen much on offense here from either side these last few drives. Take the checkdowns. We've hit a wall, so to speak. We're gonna try and get that 300 yards passing. Okay, we're at 100. We're 200 attainable, but it's not. It's not highly attainable. Um. I would say the probability of getting it is incredibly slim, so I'm almost ready to give up on that dream, but not quite yet. Oh, that's a great route. Over the middle, that's caught by Metcalf. Different. Way to go, DK. Way to go, DK. Simple route combo. That's a super simple route combo. Okay, I'm I'm content with three points. If I mean, three points is what I get. And find a way to start coming down with them. And this time, contact and another incomplete. Let's take three. We need to, we need to look in the mirror. I need to have a long look in the mirror and say, okay, when we actually needed to come out here and throw for 300. Oh, no. Did I kick this enough? The kick by McManus is good. Like, when I actually had to go throw for a bunch of yards, it was a complete fail. That's, a, that's something that makes you look in the mirror a little bit. Two are going to throw. Play action, now it's Tua. Oh, he's, he threw it where I wanted him to throw it. To get ready, it's first and goal. Boy, Moffe, that's two. Here's Tua. Oh, you're crazy. You're crazy for that throw. I was lurking. I was there. I promise I was there. No, dude, it's not. It's not sweet out here. It's just not. Wiggins, I love you, bro. It's not sweet out here. This is the best secondary I've ever seen in my entire life. Oh my gosh! And Kelvin, who was probably the worst of the bunch, just got two interceptions. All I'm gonna say is the future is bright. Offensively, it is offensive how bad our offense is right now. I'm just starting to, I, like, that's desperate. I'm just literally blindly throwing a Metcalf. Okay, I give up on our getting the game day goal. Let's just, let's just go. Good job. There you go. First and ten. And we see yet another errant throw as a result. Just don't drop it. I'm afraid of Ramsey. I am afraid of Ramsey, but don't have to be. This is a 3-0 team that we just held to zero points. 
By literally just playing unreal defense, and our D line is gonna get crazy because of the. That was a wild play call by me. That one is. That's a. That was a. That was a. That was something. Got him. Gigi's, uh, Gigi's. Okay, so going into that game, and that's why the run game was definitely neglected. I had a hope to come in and like obviously. Oh, that's actually I get good accuracy the next day. I had a hope to get 300 yards, but we win the game handedly, and we get a ton of ridiculously good stats from it. Um, we end with two touchdowns. I didn't run the ball for that reason, but D-line D wise, Mafe, who's having a great year, and Calvin Joseph, Nate Wiggins gets a pick. This team's a movie right now, and everyone, you guys are all just invited to watch it. This team is an absolute movie at the moment. Um, 12 touchdowns to three picks isn't bad. Mafe's having a crazy year. Barron's having a good year. They just send, hopefully, cross your little fingers. Cross your fingers that we get some, like Mafe and Joseph both just had amazing games. Got a breakout linebacker. Okay, how do I do this? Oh gosh, why is my camera always dead? Okay, I'm back. Coach, I was reviewing our game film and two things stood to me, our defense was lights out. You're welcome, by the way. Oh, th thank you, Scott. Uh, Boya Mafe might've been the best friend of the Fifty Nine Islands in another big game. Okay, 200 total yards. Okay, I gotta play like a loser. I gotta play like a loser. I'm sorry, I do. I gotta control the clock. I got to, I gotta just play weird and win. If I, if we're talking five years down the line, getting Boyan Mafia to superstar right now will be 10 times, 10 to 50 times more important than anything else. I'm just telling you right now, that will be more important than no matter what we do in this league, there will be nothing that matters more than getting Boyan Mafia to superstar at this point. Like that's how to do it, I really don't know. Um, I got to hold him under 200 yards, which is tough. But if we run the ball, if we control the clock a little bit, I think it's doable. Man, oh man, would that help? Okay, week five. Let's go. Purdy now to throw. Look at this defense. Look at the. Okay, that's that might be Brandon Ayuk, but like that's Julian Love and Devin Witherspoon. So I don't care who you are. I love this defense. Imagine if we could start getting some superstars on the line just to like. Yep, got him. He's got nothing. It's KG out here. It is absolutely KG out here. When I play man on man and I use her and I get like, there's people are, there's nobody open for these dudes. Like, this is a different experience than we've had in any other franchise. This is a truly elite level defense. And it's going to be a matter of, can I figure out how to get this offense good enough? I'm going to try new playbooks. I'm going to try new things. But I'm going to kill clock here. I know it's lame, but I want to hold them to under 200 yards. They'll run with Walker to begin the drive. Second and nine now. Like, this is a better offense for him. This this offense does not require a lot of, like, crazy lateral movements. Like, it's not... The other one is super dependent on being able to roll out and being insanely athletic and all of the above. But this one is, like, quite... Like, you, you can sit in the pocket and still be elite in the offense that I'm running right now. So, hopefully, we can just... Play this simple. We don't overthink anything. And we leave here with the super. Good job, Rourke! That's pocket right there. Well done, Rourke. Kenneth. That's a Okay, actually, right now. Because his first drive sucks so bad. Right now, I hate being this guy. It's early. He's done this to me once before. Oh, gosh. I hate being this guy, but part of me thinks I just try and, like, take the clock down, get ball at half, do something similar, and win the game. Like, Boya Mafe goes up to Superstar. I'm smiling forever. Like, he's big, he's strong, he's fast. Like, that's a... That's going to matter. Playoff-wise, Super Bowl-wise... That's gonna matter. Whereas this game, and I shouldn't lose, but like, 
is a difficult decision. I feel like I'm smart to just let Kenneth go crazy here. Now they'll throw here out of the gun. Deke. 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 Oh, that guy's got man abilities. Oh my gosh. That was a, I thought that was a good throw. Like, essentially, DK is running that route. Up, it's a comeback route. It's a one on one, but I'm pretty sure, like, Ward had um, knockout abilities. Okay, offense still, we're finding it. We're finding it. Wiggins, ah! Oh. He burned it. That's a. Mm, he burnt him off the line. Shoot. What? I never want to not be the Seahawks, bro. What? He just, that was the most disrespectful thing I've ever seen in my life. That was the most disrespectful thing I've ever seen in any deep... Wow. Thank you, Woolen. Scores less than a minute left here, but with that deficit, they've got to try to at least work their way into field goal range. To try. Long way to go and a short time to get there, but they still have time to get it done. So I'm gonna ah. watch them map this drive and see if they can get some points out. Are doing that? The 49ers now gonna use the good job by them. Purdy looking to throw on first down here. Oh, and his early struggles continue. Here's another one intercepted. <laughs> the, this is cagey. What was, the, what was the Seahawks record? Like, I have like 12 picks already. Oh my gosh. Okay, we should get the breakout. I don't really see a world where we wouldn't. But there obviously is potential that there's a world that we don't. That's a beam. That's a beam. That's a beam. Good job, guys. Okay, we're buzzing. Like here, he's only got 38 total yards with a long drive here. I think I think we can secure the boy Amafe burger. And then Nwosu has two sacks. This can, I think, who knows, maybe we even trigger our next defensive breakout. This could be the greatest defensive franchise of all time. The way it's going right now, it's kind of looking like it. And I just don't want to stop it. Good run. Anything because you're right, he's pretty much been completely neutralized. Yo, Rourke, I just can't with him sometimes. I honestly, I can't. Oh my gosh, he misses. Like, if we, if I get to the point where I feel like I can win a Super Bowl, I'm gonna, I just don't know if it's gonna be him. He misses every single throw. Like, unless he either makes insane throws or he misses wide open post routes like that. Like, that was that was a very easy read and throw that he just missed. Like, there was nothing difficult about that whatsoever. That's the frustrating thing. Okay, he's got 77 yards. I literally need a perfect... If I, if I don't get the Mafe breakup because of that, I'm going to lose... My mind. Purdy will set up to throw it here. Wiggins. And for a third time tonight, he's intercepted. The Legion, baby. And the Seahawks are going to take over. The Legion. Okay, now we run. Exceptions in the National Football League. And this is a guy that has all the physical tools, but the thing that sets him apart is between the Okay, he, he's shown nothing on offense. I think even if I were to just... Take the clock down a little bit, run. We'd leave here with a boy of my favorite. This guy's 0-4. He's not actually bad. He's had decent seasons in other leagues, but like our division, the Rams are really good in our division, and the Cardinals are pretty good in our division. So it's like this guy, this was a in terms of people to get this breakout against, this is probably one of the better ones. On third and short, they'll try and pick it up through the looking to throw. Looking left side, and he's got a man. That's Walker. <laughs> That's so, that was so crazy. Okay, guys, I think we're going to leave here with a Boya Mafe breakout. An absolute Snuggie. Two picks for Wiggins. And a W. Like, I think this is going to be... And two, um, two good plays from Nuosu. 
back on their hips. They're bent over, hands on their knees. And the offensive guys are just saying, let's just keep running. Dot, good, throw. Good, throw good throw. Good throw, good throw, good throw. Now it looks like he'll throw here. This one goes underneath. Good job, Walker. Good fight. Good fight. Yeah, it looks like he's. He's not even calling his timeouts at this point. This is a uh, this is GG's and guys, I'll, I'm going to be able to introduce you all to Superstar Boy Amafe after this game, which is so incredibly cool that I'm able to do. And Rourke with the touchdown. We got to talk about Rourke. He missed like three throws that game. And I'm not pumped about it, but that was an absolute snuggie. I have never seen man coverage so good as it is on this team. We get interceptions from Joseph, Woolen, and Wigan. And sacks, we get two sacks for Nuosu, who could potentially trigger some type of breakout from him. Um, guys, just, just breathe and enjoy this show. Enjoy this show, because this is beautiful. Um... Okay, if I click this, I held him to under 200 yards. It wasn't even close. Dude, such a cool breakout. Like that one, like to, to be able to take somebody who I think is a really cool player and make him a superstar this early in the franchise, like getting our first kind of superstar at 79, like he's dominant without even having a superstar ability. Now he's got a 7,600 XP bar. Um, and he's gonna just get better and just like, I am so pumped to see him progress. The other cool thing that's going on right now is Nuosu just had two sacks last week. I started him, he's a star dev guy, he's a stud and he's getting to the quarterback with ease. He's got three and a half as well. Um, currently like NFL wise, I believe we are leading the NFL in almost every single defensive static category. Defensive points per game, number two. We're out, we're allowing eight a game. We're allowing 132 passing yards. Like we are, it's not even close. We are one of the best defenses in the league. I think team stats, interception wise, we're leading. Okay, let's talk about Curtis Rourke because I seriously, I don't know what to do right now. Um, I want to look at like quarterbacks that aren't playing. Um, Slovis ran a good 40, I'm surprised. Bailey Zappi. Um, who's who's starting here? I just want to see who's starting. Just, is Watson? Yeah, it looks like Watson is starting. Um, Josh Dobbs, Devin Leary, Kyler Murray, Clayton Toon, Justin Herbert, Max. It's not a good market. Like, I would get on the phone for Sam Howell, but it's just like how much better is, I just, I feel like he's very similar to Rourke and they're going to want a lot. Trey Lance is not currently playing, but I've already had him in two leagues. So that's why I would kind of avoid that. Um, and that's just like from a content perspective, I don't want, I don't want that. Atlanta has, they drafted John Rise Plumley and they brought in Joe Milton. Plumlee's interesting because he's fast and he's young. Who's starting over here? Because Atlanta has a surplus of interesting players. It looks like Plumlee is starting. I wonder if Milton's on the bench, I would throw a pick for it. Yeah, it looks like Plumlee is their main guy in Atlanta. Daniel Jones, Cameron Ward. That would have been a good pick, but he, he's not a crazy high overall either. Sam Hartman. What about Zach Attack? Darnold's 27. Sorry, I'm just... Hendon Hooker is interesting. I think they're definitely going to be going with Jared Goff. Captain Kirk, Tyler Huntley is a, a good... I just don't see any like players here that are significantly better than what I have. That's the thing. I don't see anyone who's like... This guy's going to be way better. KJ Jefferson out of Arkansas. Similar player. Kenny Pickett's there. Justin Fields started. I, I have a pretty good relationship with the Steelers owner. I could probably talk to him about Kenny Pickett. I just don't think that's an upgrade. Davis Mills, Baker Mayfield, Will Levis. What about bringing in Malik? This is probably the most interesting quarterback room there is. I think he's starting Will Levis. 
he wouldn't trade Will Levis. But what about bringing in Malik Willis? Because Malik, Malik's not playing at all. I'm going to call the Titans. One sec. Uh, okay, so the Titans is not on right now, but and I don't like I don't know if that's a crazy good option, but his throw power and speed is really good. But the Titans aren't on at the moment. Bo Nix, Jaron Hall's a good starter, Nick Mullins. Honestly, I think uh, we're undefeated. I, I'm not gonna change anything because we're undefeated, but I am offensively defeated, but that, that can change. We can fix that. We'll see you guys week six. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, going up against the Rams. Um, this is a playoff guy in, in the leagues. He's a, he's a good player. Nate Wiggins showing that he is a stud. Got to pick that last. I think he's got two. Maybe actually. I'm trying to think. Our schedule is about to get really difficult, by the way. The Patriots are really tough. And the Lions are really tough. So just prepare for that. Um, one person who reached out to me when I was talking about a trade, uh, Wiggins has three picks, Woolen has two, and Joseph has three as well. One person who reached out to me immediately was, um, <laughs> you guessed it, the Steelers, because they think that they deserve a second round pick for Kenny Pickett. And I'm like, yeah, bro, I can't do that. You know, like it's, it's not, it's not horrible, but it's like, I think my quarterback's better than Kenny Pickett. So it's, I would never do it. I think he's gonna figure it out. I, I trust we're gonna stop missing such obvious throws um, and things are gonna just like smooth out and we're gonna be much better. I trust in the system that even though, that no matter what we can get through this year and we can figure some things out. Curtis Rourke gets another upgrade. Like he's only, the thing is that game, he, he was supposed to have plus five accuracy and stuff, but it didn't, didn't really show, if I'm being honest. But okay, big time week, let's go. I love these retro kind of Rams uniforms. That was my favorite thing when I was the Rams. I love the uniforms that this guy has on right now. These are definitely some of my favorites. On third down, he'll drop to throw. And that is incomplete. It's a back foot throw. It's a tough throw against this defense, but Throw that I would love, love, love to see made. Shoot! They're indeed going for it as they look to throw. I got him. Going for Easy money. Let's go. Go up top, DK. I'm, I'm tired of being afraid. He's got deep on elite. He's got um, short and elite. He's got red zone threat. Just lob it to him and let him be great. I got 95 throw power and work. We're throwing picks anyways. We're getting stopped anyways. If they pick it. They pick it, but I want to start taking risks. Good start. Seven zip. They'll drop to throw. He's got a man complete. Down to the ten. Touchdown, Rams. Okay, I see you, Nakua. That's that was a great throw. Great read. Great result. Dang. That was impressive. Seven up. Walker with another carry. There we go. Way to go, Walker. Carry us a little bit, Walker. He's got four for 18. As long as he's staying in this blitz, I feel like one of the best things you can do against this blitz is just run the ball consistently. And just hope that hope that you can find some, some holes and just like figure it out. Beam, good throw. Good throw. Red zone here for first and ten. Back to throw. A repeat of the last play, finding Walker. And they've got it inside the ten at the eight. This is an important game. I want to remain undefeated in this. I know my next two people that I play are really tough. So this game just matters a lot. It matters a lot because it matters a lot. There it is. Just shuts us off. DK has red zone threat. I don't know if there's another read here. I don't know, just DK Metcalf. He missed him. Oh my gosh, okay. That was a clean miss. That was a clean, clean miss. Oh, yikes. They'll set up a throw. 
Good try, Wiggins. That's a tough matchup, and he was very close to making a very good play on that. That's a really tough matchup. Now a first down carry. It's Williams. Oh, he's got a little daylight. They'll look to throw. Oh. Good combo. Good combo. Okay, Rourke, we're going to have to fight today, dude. We're going to have to fight. This is going to be a game we got to put up points. Like, I can't just rely on my defense stopping him every single time. i got to put up some legitimate points here. Shoot. Good play. Yep, just throw it. Throw it to him. Seven. This has been a solid performance against a good defense. Seven for 11. We're playing actually... Excellent football right now on this side of the ball. I think he's is he doing that blitz to us again. No, this is just. Yeah, good pocket. I use it. I was trying to strategically plan when I was going to take that time out, but that seemed like the right time. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. Everybody come over here and spike. Okay. Now, I knew that was going to be a tough situation. But that, that's a good drive to get us in field goal range. I'm proud of that. The stops are going to happen here. I don't know when they're going to happen, but I do believe that, like, just basing it off of our success that we've had this year, that we should be able to find a way to stop. I, I'm struggling with Cooper Cup and Nakua. The two of them together have been pretty elite this game, but we're going to figure something out. Can't stop him. Why can't we stop him? I don't know. Okay, we got we got to change some things up. This is not not a good performance. Bro, he can't. Like those are throws that need to be made. Uh, he's wide open. He was wide open. Oh my gosh, he's wide open. And then he makes that throw. That's a beauty. And then he makes that throw. He's so random with the throws. Why don't you just make every throw? I'm on the clock, though, here. This isn't a great situation. I'm on the clock. I just wanted three. I sold myself out of it. I just, all I needed was three points. All I needed was three, and I sold myself out of three points. A millisecond difference. They'll drop the throw. Pass complete there to McCool. They'll let the QB keep it here off the option. Well, how about the moving parts on a play like this? You know you have to practice it over and over because Damn. Kieran Williams just punched us in the face. Okay, Rourke, let's have this. This is going to be an interesting stretch for this team. It really is. That's a good throw. Way to go. Hey, Curtis, this has been a, a bit of a tough game for us. Defense this is my worst game by far. Um, and we'll have other chances against this opponent. We'll, we'll have chances to hopefully make up for this. To throw here on first down. And he'll try again with the arm here on second down. Nice catch. Walker. walker, you're the best, man. You are the best, Walker. Okay, maybe we can get an onside and something crazy here. Let's just go for it. Dot. JSN. Those are good throws. Those are legitimate throws. Okay. This would give us a Hail Mary chance. That's a nice onside. Ah, that's a cool. Covered by the hands. 
Jeez, GG's, man. Okay, I got... I struggled. I struggled against the two receivers. Majorly, majorly, majorly struggled against those two receivers. Um, I missed some reads. I didn't feel overly confident on offense. But it is what it is. Good game to my opponent. We're going to get a chance to see him again. We're going to get a chance to... we got to play the Patriots and the Lions coming up. We're both really... Like, this... Our season could change really quick if we don't win some games. Good game. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Wah, let's go. Okay, don't stress about the past. You know, we had a tough game. Don't stress about what happened. Smile because we're here. And smile because we're having a pretty good year. We struggled that game. I'm not going to lie. That was not my most beautiful game. Defensively, we got humbled. And I think getting humbled isn't always a bad thing because you get to, like, look in the mirror or the camera and be like, okay. I gotta figure some stuff out. I wanna bring Julian Love back. Uh, I'm gonna up his offer a little bit. Okay. Dude does not wanna play. Okay, we're going up against the Patriots. This guy's really good. Packers in the other franchise is a tough out. Let's go. Back to throw now on first down. Got him, let's go, man! Good pick, kid. Get up, get up, Reed. Okay, we're back. Don't worry about me, because I'm back. Worry about yourself, because you're not back. I'm back. Go, go, Kenneth! Go. Yep, cut in, back. Big run, Kenneth Walker the third. Let's go, man. Beautiful start to this. I love my job. Someday, I just, I love it. Second and four. Too much time. Oh, that's a that's a crime to give that much time. Shoot. Second and five. Good job. Well done, boy Amafe. Hmm, that's a good play. That guy, he wins right off the cut. Okay, good play. Really good play. Good job, Kenneth. Okay, he figured us out a little bit. So this is when it comes down to like, okay, can we figure out a way to be efficient on offense, win the game? Like, we're going to have tough games this year. We're going to have a lot of ridiculously tough games this year. Ken, like, how are we going to respond when someone is scoring against us? Someone, when our defense is no longer carrying us? Are we going to be there or are we going to suck? Good job, Walker. Good run. On second down, it's Walker. Kenneth Walker. Well done, Walker. You can't stop the run. That's o that's the only way that this guy I've ever been able to really beat him is to just rely on the run game. Like, as simple as that. Come out, run the ball. Let Kenneth Walker go crazy because he is amazing. Kenneth Walker is absolutely amazing. Okay, 14-7. Now they'll switch it up here and look to throw. And he's got his man in. He'll drop to throw. Juju, are you kidding me? Oh, that's not Juju. That's Brian Thomas. I was going to say, I'm like, Juju, that's moderately insane. Good defense. Good defense. Good defense. Timeout. Good defense. Timeout. I think he probably takes three here. He does. Okay, red zone, dead zone. I... Talk about things you love. Things you love to see. Okay. Mm. We get Paul at half two. And we have, like, a little bit of time here to do something. Oh. Shoot. Ah, oh, that's on me. Can Roar get this to the end zone? No. Okay, we'll just run here. We'll just run here. Shoot, man! Ah! 
I needed to get out of bounds on the last one. That's that was my issue. I had to get out of bounds on that. It's okay. Okay. Halftime. Be smart. Be smart. We've done well running the ball. Don't be afraid to go back to that. Lead now a chance to expand upon that lead here with their first drive in the third quarter. Yeah, believe it or not. Nice catch, DK. On the money. Way to go, Rourke. Take with him to contract negotiations, doesn't he? Oh my gosh, I quick snap myself right there. I was still doing adjustments. For the snap. Back to throw. Oh, he's gonna let this go for the Rourke. Oh my gosh, Rourke! We caught him in cover zero. You gotta make that throw. That was cover zero. That was there. Oh my gosh. This this cube is Ah, he outran the zone. He outran the zone. He'll look to throw. He's able to find Melton. They'll look to throw again. Hit him, Brett. Hit him. They're going to look to throw. It's just too much time. That much time is a crime. Can't give someone that much time in the pocket. You really can't. On first down, he'll drop to throw. Okay, he's gonna go onside here. Um, this isn't shocking at all. It's probably the right call at this stage. He's gonna try and. <laughs> DK, that was tough. I thought I was in a world of trouble right there. Thank you, DK Metcalf. I thought we were done. I really thought we were done. The first down run goes backwards. Go up, Fant. Way to go, Fant. Okay. <laughs> we need seven either way. He's buzzing. He's doing a really, really, really good job on uh, on offense. So. I just need to score. Okay, play ball. Is he going to clock me though? That's the million dollar question. Do I kick this? What do you do? It's funny because man on man seems to do literally nothing against that. That's what I find annoying. Get off my field! Surprise! Sit down. Oh, I scored. Got him. I ran commit. I ran commit and then user it. That, my friends, is defense. That's how you win a game. After the pick six, they go right back to the air. Looking to throw. Now a desperation throw deep downfield. Shoot. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. See that this is why I was trying to sit down there. I didn't I didn't want to score. And this is gonna be taken in by the Seahawks. But it would appear they're on GG's man. GG's. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, big time win. Um, the Steelers have tried to call me about the picket trade. I'm ignoring all calls right now. All calls are blocked. For the time being, all calls, my phone, my phone lines are dead because I don't want to talk to anybody. I don't want to talk to anybody about trades. I'm just, I'm just living. I'm just playing basketball. Um, Malik Cunningham's a stud and I, I find myself here again. Um, <laughs> I find myself in the exact same place that I was earlier uh, looking at quarterbacks. It's just the most ready right now is Mariota. But it's just you get nothing out of it. We're winning. You know what? We're winning. Yeah, he misses 93% of his throws. But who doesn't? I'm just worried like, okay, this is my real long-term fear. I'm worried we make the playoffs. We have an unreal year. 
and we could potentially go on a run with this team and quarterback is the reason that we don't that's my biggest fear in the world so at the end of the day that's that's what i'm worried about we're gonna try and figure that out we're gonna try and go from there jarek reed what a pick two more big games let's win them both they'll come out throwing here to start the drive and the lions pressure where did chop robinson come from Respect to him, but that's a crazy blitz. There's something weird about that blitz because that guy This is my best player. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. They'll get this out wide to Metcalf. A man who played collegiately over in East Lansing. Here's Ken Walker. Okay. Score on the first drive, score on every drive. Simple as that. It's a gain of 12 first down seasons. Score on the first drive, score on every... I do want to get Rourke, like, even his accuracy stats could go up, like, 20. That's, see, that's a... See, then there's flashes where he looks great. There really is. Good throw. Three for three. Dot, good throw. Nice catch, Lockett. There we go. Good run. This is a bit of a difficult decision. He's got a great red zone. I have good defense. I do feel like I know the right decision and I know the wrong decision. Red zone threat. I'm not... If someone called me up to the stand and said, was that a good read? I probably wouldn't say yes. But for now, I'm not under oath. That was a good read. Dance. Dance. Devin Witherspoon. Let's go, man. No. That was a special. He's getting fined. If the NFL doesn't find him for that, that's twenty. That's easy 25 grand. Number three overall pick. Probably won't affect him. But beautiful. Uh, he's going to try and take the clock down. Respect to him for it. Respect. Out of the gun. Gone. Everything falling apart. We're back, baby. We are so back. Tariq Willen. They need to play an almost perfect second half to have a solid chance. And that absolutely starts with finding some. Got him. intercepted. <laughs> Picked off by Jamal. Jamal Adams, dude. This is a snuggie. This is an absolute snuggie. That's so perfectly led. That's so perfectly led. Did you see how he kind of... He raced. I haven't even had to play offense. This, this game, all I've done is play defense. And he is absolutely in shambles out here, which is why I love this franchise. That... Okay, I'll take three. He's actually a good player, so I'm not going to be stupid in this situation, and I'm not going to lose this game. They tough for them to get yards against, let alone put points up on the board. Eluding the pressure right. Shoot, good play. See what I mean? Like, he can move. I just know this guy's going to be a problem. Like, foreshadowing, there's going to be a playoff game where me and him have a crazy game. And I want to make sure I start off this series with a crazy win game this contest is now lopsided because of their efforts and there's still a quarter got him. and for the fourth time tonight it's an interception got him and the seahawks will take over here why so soon i don't know why i don't know why he's leaving so soon he must have somewhere to be it's 2 14 on a sunday where would he i don't know where he'd have to go but he's, he left just so soon. Hello, good Hello. sir. Hello, Bob. 
Okay, what what's the ask? What's the ask for Mr. Kenny Pickett? I'm not. I don't have much for you, but I'm. I'd consider. I know, to your team, you you don't got much going on. Well, it's not like you're gonna get. What are you expecting? I, I I'm not asking for a lot. I, I do know that you need a, a quarterback. I don't need a quarterback. You need a quarterback. I, um. You have G- you have Geno Smith, so I think no, I don't. Work. It's not just Geno. Well, Geno can come back. I haven't even thought about that. If things, I can bring back Geno whenever I want to bring back Geno. Oh, you're you're, what, you're rocking that Canadian dude. Yeah, I am. Hey, how's that going for you? I'm seven and one. <laughs> I mean, fair enough. But you wouldn't be calling me unless you needed a quarterback. Well, fair enough. Okay, what's the offer then? I. It's not that I. I'm, I'm not dying for Kenny Pickett. But I want insurance. I feel like I can win a bowl with this team. I feel good. I'm feeling strong. I what pick? <laughs> well, who's even asking for a pick? Well, I'm not gonna I can't give you a player mid season. Alright, well I'm willing to give you Kenny Pickett, the quarterback of your franchise. For a second round See, pick. See, this is where it's just it's we're not on the same page. I don't even think he's worth a third. Oh, come on now. It's a starting quarterback. Well, no, it's a former starting quarterback. Why did you go away from him? And he's 27 because years I old. You get Justin Fields. You act like he's not 27 years old. He's 27. He's, he's really 27. I didn't know that. But <laughs> he, he's, still, he's still got something in him. Yeah. Then start him. Trade. You, you know what? You, you know what? Trade me. Trade me Fields. You start him. <laughs> uh, that's not happening. So the second. Justin Fields is just as the quarterback of this franchise. Yeah, no, I feel now like I, could, I was. You I gave up everything. Fields, so I yeah. wanted him. Tough. I know. Tough. Tough is right. Okay, I would. I'm gonna give this guy a couple more games. I would give you a fourth or a fifth. We don't even do five rounds in the draft. Well, you get a fourth. <laughs> I the best I'll do is a third. I'm not going to four. My third. Okay, I'll consider that. All right. Okay, right. I'll get back to you. Is he worth a third? I just don't see it. Honestly, he's just sitting on the bench, starting quarterback caliber type player, but more of a more of a rental. I don't know if he does that many things better than the QB that I have currently. So that's the th- like, even to give up a third is just, I would give up like a fifth just to bring him in, but a third is what, well- and it's not like Rourke's sucks. That's the thing. Like 16, to- it's just, we're not winning any games because of him. We're winning games just by being really good everywhere else. That last game I didn't win because of Rourke. I run it because of the defense. We have the best defense in the league, bar none. We'll talk after the bye week. Let's just, let's just go throw the ball. Ew. This is that Plumley guy. Plumley is <laughs> Plumley's fast. Like I'm not gonna. I consider drafting him just because he is. He's quick. Like 90 speed is no joke. Um, but, but he's not starting. You know what, Desmond Ritter. Like if we're if I was gonna draft a quarterback next year, maybe I need to get on the phone with this guy. He's not playing Desmond, and he's not playing Joe Milton. Like he's got a surplus of QBs, where if things start going really bad for me, I could bring in Joe Moneyman Milton um, just as a second option and see if he can make some more throws. Oh my gosh, how many... Is this guy running an 8 QB system? Why is there 14 quarterbacks out here? What the heck is going on? Okay, so now I think he starts Milton. Because Milton is... Get over here. Good job. This is weird. They're gonna look to throw. That's Samuel caught left side. And that was the coaching staff. They kind of predicted that they would come out firing like this. I think you and I were a little skeptical that Boy above! Let's go! This guy who okay, so he's playing everyone except Desmond. Give me young Desmond. I trade a third for young Desmond. If things get rough, and I'm, I'm going to take a QB next year, I would do a third for Desmond, 100%. Out of the gun, they'll look to throw. Escaping the pressure right. 
Yikes. 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 That was not good. Didn't like that. Third down. Two yards to go. Are you going to stay in this? Well, tell me that you're about to run a play action fake without telling me you're about to run a play action fake. This Plumley kid. This Plumley kid's kind of cold. Like, I, I definitely see the appeal, but Desmond Ritter is sitting on the bench, and he's pretty good in this game. Like, he would be a capable one year starter. If I'm. I would offer him a four for Desmond if he's not even playing. And that way, if Rourke is selling, I have a. I, mean, I, have, I could go to Geno, too. That's the thing. Looking to throw. I need to just make it attainable. That was excellent blitzing on his part. It's man on man though now. It's man on man. So it's hard to say if it's a man on man blitz or a man on man just chill. It's just man on man chill. Tyler Lockett. So dependable. Good catch, Tyler. Okay, this guy, he's kind of confusing me, but I do think there's a chance he's just blitzing. Like, that, see, those are the throws that I just, I don't want to pull the plug on this thing because I've already invested so much, but like, oh, I know I can't win with them. That's the thing. I just feel like in my heart of hearts, I know I can't win with him. So it's like, I don't know why I'm prolonging this. That's a dot, though. Good user, bro. Take the mittens off. My gosh. He's got his warmest winter mittens on right now with that user. That was horrible. That was special. That was nice. That was really, really, really nice. That was man on man. Five seconds left and we get ball. Okay. Be great today. Be great. And you just man that DB up. He's not He can slide. He must have got his awareness must be like 70 now. That's Rourke's. That's his first slide. You're too good, Lockett. You are too good, Lockett. Perfect route at the top, laser. Metcalf, one on one, and throwing it every time. I'm, I'm done overthinking. I'm done overthinking. I have red zone threat. DK Metcalf I'm throwing it to him. I don't care about anything else. I'm just gonna throw him the ball. 14-3. Point deficit as they start things out with a first and ten. See now Joe Milton's in. Like he's got a full like wow. He's got quarterbacks everywhere here. From the shotgun, he'll look to throw. Flush to his right. Good job, Mafe. Needed it. Needed it. He'll drop to throw. Flushed out right. Give me those. Because you feel like you're into the open field, and maybe you don't feel the people who go JSN. JSN. Back to throw now on first down. That's on me. That's on me. That's a, that's that's poor judgment on my part. That's poor judgment. Around the NFL, they all say the exact same thing. They're so fundamentally sound, it's hard to execute against them. They'll look to throw here on first down. Now a play fake here on first down. He's gonna wind up and air it out. Witherspoon. That's Malik Neighbors. Can't be that mad about that. It's one of the best receivers in the class. Shoot! That fumble by me was horrible. And this is caught. They got it. He's going on 
so. Three or second outside kick in the game. No, he's not. Interesting. Okay. Rourke, we literally can't mess up. Walker, run the ball. Get us out of here. I, I don't want another loss. Especially not in this one. Yep. I thought he had short zone KO, and I thought there was a chance we would really regret that, but thankfully he did not. Okay, take the clock down a little bit here. Thing is, seven points is still does a lot in this situation. And that plays wide open again. Good job. He's just running cover two blitz. Like, I once lost a game running cover two against the same play that I just ran, so I, I know all about that play. Rourke, you're so good. Yep. That's not worst case scenario. I could probably... I need seven is the thing. And I know I've seen his red zone defense before. It's kind of tough. But not tough enough. Good play. Let's go. Okay. If we can go eight and one into the bye week, I'm a happy guy. In mind already, but they can't get ahead of themselves. They know that they need to score quickly. Yep. <laughs> this defense is so mean. Oh my gosh, good defense, guys. Good job, Moffat. That counts. Yep, two for him. Two for him. Back to throw. Much downfield that there's room to run, but this time he decided to throw it unsuccessfully. He's gonna let it fly. Well, and you better pick that for the freebie. These remind me of an empty net goal. In uh, that's like an empty net goal in hockey. Free stats, and everybody wants to pick. Woolen is the perfect person to get it to because he's the one that I care most about diving him up to superstar. Guys, Rourke, he hears you. He hears everybody talking. He knows he missed his throws. He has a great game. Two sacks on defense for us. We get a pick with Woolen. Is it perfect? No, but it's really, really good football. Okay, we'll see you guys next week. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, week number 11. Going up against the Jaden Daniels and Marvin Harrison Jr., led squad over here in Chicago. Um, I thought last week was one of the best weeks. The last two weeks, I felt like both were really elite level performances. Drake May leading the NFL. Rourke's not gonna win any like rookie of the year type thing. Walker, Lockett is having an insane season. JSN is struggling and I haven't been able to get him the balls nearly as much as I want to. Boya Mafe is having an excellent year. Uh, Barron's having a good year, so is Woolen now. Going into this game, I want to start using my staff points. I have 117. I want to put it first. Like, so there's, oh, this is where it's tough. I don't like any of these. I don't. But I, I want to make sure I use it on offensive development. So like this, if I use these two, it increases my quarterback XP gains significantly. Um wide receivers tight end i'm not as concerned with that free safeties strong safeties cornerbacks um i want to switch my coach to get the one where the quarterbacks can get the plus three throw power and stuff so that'll probably be my move next but at least now i know that i'm gonna be getting more xp every single time with rourke because I'm trying my best to make him good. I'm trying to have a really good year. So he's got he's eighth in passing passing touchdowns as of right now. Um, offensive rookie of the year. He's fourth. So it's not like he's having a bad year. It's just not like an insane season. His passer rating is pretty decent. We're not making a lot of mistakes. Is the nice thing. Okay. Ooh, we got upgrades. I didn't realize we had upgrades here. Um, a lot of upgrades. Kenneth is going to get an upgrade night by the end of the year. He'll probably be 95. Overall, meaning he'll get human joystick, which is fun. DK Metcalf, I think his playmaker should be at the point where I could get hot routes. But I just don't know if I care enough. I don't like hot route masters that much. I don't use it that much, which is, is weird and not great. Boy, Amafe, finally, finally. Okay, so his XP bar is 8,200, which isn't bad. It's not amazing, but he's really good. 
So hopefully, 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 we can just go crazy, keep that superstar, and kind of like work together to try and get that to the point where he's like a 90 overall and the face of the defense. He's our only superstar on defense. So um, even though we have an amazing defense, he is at this point our only superstar. Baron gets an upgrade. He's going to get a plus one on hybrid um, up to a 73 overall plus one agility. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, never mind. Curtis Rourke. Scrambler. His improviser is low. Like we're fighting over here and we're a 66 overall. He gets throw power, 97. He's not bad. He really isn't. But okay, let's go. They'll start this drive out on the ground. I like what this guy did though. Like you trade your pick, you take Marvin Harrison Jr., you draft Daniels later. Like you end up with a ton of assets. You got a superstar D line, like Bears played this amazing. I hope to, I want to do a Bears franchise too at some point. Maybe, probably more likely after the draft, but I feel like the Bears are a really fun team in this game. Out of the gun, they'll look to throw. You good, bro? <laughs> Best defense I've ever had. Good throw. He's only, the thing is, Lockett's only 89 speed. As difficult as that is to believe, just given how good he is, he's not like ridiculously fast. He's just unbelievably good at football. Like, he's he's been our best target all season. Lockett's easily our best player. Dot, let's go, DK! Well done, DK. Well done, DK. That was, I love that. Just like throw a slant, push somebody. That was one of Roar's best drives of the year. And I'm, it's kind of, maybe because I'm in a different playbook, but maybe more suited to him. I don't know. This Jaden's getting cooked by the man defense. Like, this is bad. Yeah, let's just start doing that. Red zone threat. DK, no pass. Every time. Okay, it looks like Rourke's not the only rookie, but Jaden is struggling out here. Jaden is missing throws left, right, and center. He was picked with, I think, pick 11. This guy got Jaden Daniels, I believe. Uh, see, that's a good throw. That's a good read. On play action, they'll throw. They're firing a deep ball for Komet. Got his man, and it's caught. Funny thing to get him out of that lethargy right at the beginning. What a route by Lockett. I think that's, I don't know, was that Stevenson he was against? That was a perfect route, though. Now on first down, he'll drop to throw it. <laughs> he hits his target, Lockett. I just love Tyler Lockett. To me, it's like, he's just the best. He's the best player that nobody ever talks about. My gosh, and he's been doing it for so long, too. This is the Tyler Lockett game. Imagine I get a, I deserve a breakout with him. He's caught every single ball for this entire game. Back to throw again. You might want to slide Rourke. And this turns into a nice game. You don't have to, but you might want to. Second and goal. And he'll be third and goal. They'll try and run Walker. <laughs> We're dialed. Don't don't talk to me, but we are dialed in right now. Beautiful. 21-8. A lot of different looks. It seems a little bit confused trying to complete passes. Now a play fake here on first down. There's Moody. Again, he'll drop to throw. Escaping the pressure right. 
Even though he has no timeouts, I want the ball back on the off chance he scores because he'll he probably will have time to call some plays. It's the dumbest throw I've ever seen in my life. It's the worst decision I've ever seen rewarded. That should have been Julian Love's second pick. Because Love is one that he wants. Love wants twenty million a year, almost like nineteen or something. I want to keep him, but like I'd love if he got a breakout. Rourke's a, Rourke's a genius. That was an inaccurate throw that worked perfectly because... Wow, that was amazing. That was an inaccurate, but just because of the way that whole thing went down... Huntsman fits. I promise he's, he's in like... He's in some weak... Man on man right here. Rourke, like you're throwing it to the fans, dude. You're throwing it to the fans. Why are we throwing the ball to the fans? Almost. That was good defense. I needed to play before. That was well done. They'll try and start this drive in the air. Flush to his right. This game's way closer than it needs to be. Lock it. That's a cold route, Lock it. That's a cold route right there. Oh my god. That's unreal. Like, that's one-on-one -on -one coverage. Who else would you rather have? Oh, second one. Rourke, if that's... Oh. Clutch. On play action, they'll throw. He's going to let this go. Back of the end zone. End zone caught. Touchdown, Seattle. DK. They'll drop to throw. On the move to his left. And he's going to be intercepted a third time. Good job. That's three. They go play action here on first down. And some room to work. He's got four for 49. This has been kind of, not even really kind of. This has been a really impressive Rourke performance. Oh, here. That's to his running back, complete. Touchdown, Seahawks. GG's, dude, GG's. Dang, Rourke, have a day. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, so B Corms took the Packers, and he's gone. He's a YouTuber, though, so he gets to keep his team. We get a force win, and these are my stats. Just wait. It gets it gets even better. This Just wait. Julian Love, Tariq Woolen gets a pick. This, this gets better, okay? Watch this. Are you ready? Kill the like button when you see it. I love this game. Now, is this an optimal? It's really difficult to do. It's really difficult to do, but if done, it changes the trajectory of the entire franchise. It's really, really, really difficult to do. Also, Roar. He's had back-to-back -back crazy games. Throw one or fewer interceptions and have 300 scrimmage yards or three total touchdowns. It's about to go down, guys. A divisional game, too. Like, this is a tough out at home. Like, in a situation like this, I got nothing else to say. We got... Oh, the thing is, 
there's just so many ways to look at this and I just don't know what the way I want to look. Um, I don't know how I want to do this because the Julian Love breakout would be more important long term. But Rourke's also ridiculously important. Like getting that breakout would do wonders for us. Even though he's struggled, you got a chance to get a star dev, six foot five, 96 throw power rookie. Like that's not a joke. Julian Love, however, he gets his breakout. You, like the Legion starts really happening. The Legion really starts happening because um, we're about to find out if Nate Wiggins is a superstar or not. If he's a superstar, sign the check. Wait for the abilities? No, he's not. He's starred up. You can tell when you get to 80 because if he's a superstar that he'll, he'll get something. Um, this is a difficult person to have this against. I kind of need to run the ball and try and just get the three touchdowns. He got another throw power. Oh my gosh, it's up to 98. I kind of need to run the ball and try to figure things out that way. But two breakouts. Let's get it. Okay, Julian Love has an elite opportunity right here. That's not good. Oh, that's not good. I think it's 150 passing yards though, isn't it? Like the fact that he's running right now. I often think in situations like this with Julian Love, let him run. Run as much as your little heart desires to run. I, I like why pinch my defense line. I want him to run. Once again, it's Jacobs. Like, I just have to hold him to 150 passing yards, and I get an insanely important beginning to the Legion. Here's Jacobs, a first superstar in the secondary, and a guy who I I'm gonna pay anyways. I'm telling you right now, this matters. I love this game. I love that he's running the ball. I might just let him run the ball all game. Literally, just like no pinch line, just totally play a little bit dumb to it and try and get the 150 that way. That's definitely a plan. Murray now, third and goal. Buddy's just throwing stuff. Some people make reads. I don't think he got a single passing yard by whole drive, did he? I don't, I don't believe there was a single passing yard that entire drive. I could be wrong, but he ran time. Precisely what I wanted him to do. Little does he know, he just did exactly what we wanted him to do. He'll drop to throw. Let's go, Metcalf! Good catch, DK. Okay, need 303 touchdowns, but also we want to... Back to throw now on second and 10. Heads up. We also kind of, we want to stop him from getting 150 yards. Now that I, if I actually process this, he just didn't score. If I have a long drive here, we could potentially pull this thing off with a good, long, like, just kind of annoying drive. I think we could do it. On third down, here's Walker. Inside the 30. Inside the 10. I went out the one, so I'm just so I can do this. Lord, you're a beast! You are a beast for that! It's their quarterback. Good job. Do you see how he, he pushed him over? He's huge. Six foot five. Like that's a he's good. Man, what a success story that would be. Like, Rourke just randomly becomes the GOAT? Imagine. Can hear me out. It could happen. I just want him to keep running the ball. So I'm going to keep, like, I'm going to spread my lines just so he runs it. See? Like, he thinks, he thinks he's the one laughing here. I'm laughing at him. I just have to hold you to under 150 passing yards. So I'll let you run the entire way down the field. You know what? Take a picture. Here's Show Jacobs everybody. Look, look, look at my run game. And Little does he know. Did no Julian Love break it. Little do you know, buddy. Little do you know. Go run the ball again. Out of the gun. Here's Murray. Being chased down Fox. left. Good defense. Now Murray. Too short. Okay. They're going for it. It's Murray. 
No way. No! Shut up! I love this franchise. Good job, Julian. That's one. I don't. He needs two or less than 150. And I believe we get ball at half. So, like, if our drive after half, even if we take 30% of the clock away from him, that could add up. This is. Here's the Seattle offense ready to get this drive underway. Excellent job. And of course, this a critical game. Excellent, excellent, Not excellent job. Race, but playoff seeding as well. They are a game up, but a loss here could really muddy the waters. And both these teams want to clear things. Way to go, Kenneth. Way to go, sir. Here's a second and seven. Well, the catch is made here by Tyler Lockett. Tyler Lockett loves him. Tyler Lockett loves Roy. You just can tell. You can tell by the, I don't have to even you know you know why. You just you can tell by the way he plays. He loves his quarterback. As you should. From the gun, it's Walker. He'll look to throw. Stud. Absolute stud. You need seven here. We need seven with him. He'll look to throw. Oh, Fant! 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 Help him out. So that's two for Ward at this stage, and he doesn't have a ton of passes. Yet. That's two touchdowns for him. We get ball at half. So if after half I can have a long running kind of like, not necessarily kill clock, but control the clock type drive, I think we can get both breakouts. I really do. Murray now on first down. Flush to his right. Fine again. And Murray with a smart Technically fine with him because it's not a it's not a passing yard. So technically, I got no issues with it. All I care about is making sure that you, in every situation, choose a run. Looking to throw. Second and ten. Let's go, dude. Take your three. Take it. Take your three. Okay, we get ball. I need another touchdown with Rourke um, in order to get Rourke's breakout to star, which is obviously super important. I would say Loves is a little bit more important, but set up right now. He's good for ball. So, fingers crossed. The message was too drastic, I think, at the half, or that they need to change things too much. Go run. So, take a little bit of clock here. Let's shorten this game a bit. Yep, you got it. Well done, Walker. Do I want to just totally commit? Thing is, I'm putting myself in a difficult spot for the... Uh, I'm putting myself in a difficult spot for the Rourke breakout if I play... Slow here, but I honestly think just running the ball and trying to just like get a QB sneak or a short run. He has no run D, so like let's just keep this up. They'll try for the first with Walker. Good run. Three ten. He's got like no. Oh, I don't even think he gets to pick up this. I'm just going to give the ball to Charbonnet until we get close. Just continue to pound the rock. I like Charbonnet a lot. Now they'll switch it up here and look to throw. Back in the end zone. DK Metcalf! No. That's how Rourke gets it is on the greatest catch I've ever seen in my life. Look where Rourke puts this ball. That's the greatest catch and throw. And ladies and gentlemen, Curtis Rourke is now star development. But who's counting? Who's paying attention? I am. Who do you think you are? I am. 21 3. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, <laughs> this is such a snuggy. I love this bad coverage that we got. Julian Love is a superstar. You guys might not get it, but like, he's already an 85 overall. He'll get KO abilities. He'll get everything like out the gate. Okay, he still only has 36 passing yards. That's a good throw, though. Murray now.
It's all right. I want you to run the ball. From the red zone, here's the Heisman Trophy winner, Murray. Witherspoon, yep. And this is going to be intercepted. Picked off by Devin Witherspoon. Maybe the most dominating double breakout performance of the 21st century. I honestly don't know. He may have had 20 passing yards. And Julian Love gets a pick. And the best dot I've ever seen with Rourke. Um, that, my friends, is how you pull off a double breakout week. That is how you do it. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful execution. And then, also on top of it, we get our tandem breakout. Metcalf is crazy, too. Curtis Rourke also gets his breakout. Dude, this is about to be a movie. That is so clutch. So now, now I'm going back to Julian. I'm like, hey, let's... Let's reopen this negotiation, you know? Like, I'm not, I didn't mean to offend you. Take the player friendly. What? I'm gonna have to franchise tag him. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to franchise tag him. And I will, because look at what he gets now. Deep out zone, deep in zone, and mid zone KO. He becomes one of the best safeties in the league with one insane breakout. That's crazy. That's the best breakout, like, Best case scenario, I could see in the off season too, I could definitely see some of these dudes like, okay, so Woolen's having a great year, Witherspoon's having a good year, Wiggins is having a good year, Moffe, we've gotten two new superstars on defense, Julian Love and Boya Moffe. Offensively, Rourke is now a star dev, so his XP bar goes down to 4,500. He's kind of looking like... He might be kind of that dude. I don't even... Like, what are his stats this year? I thought I sucked, but I just don't... This is my stats? What? I have 31 touchdowns and 4 picks, and I'm, I'm on the phone looking at Kenny Pickett? He misses so many throws, but we're just dialed. He's going to win the MVP if I keep this up. 31 touchdowns, 4 picks... 700 defensively a lot of guys with five picks okay a couple tough games coming up but that's a w okay ladies and gentlemen tandem breakout who would this would this be julian love um i think it would be Tariq. oh no witherspoon everyone on this team we need like rather than everyone having five picks i need like two of them to get like nine to guarantee that they get breakouts that's kind of the problem when you have everyone doing really good is nobody does really good big time week here um going up against t-sab boo i lose to t-sab on the last play every single time every game i lose to t-sab on the last play i'm just cursed it is what it is we get over it we got julian love superstar now that's a clutch one we got an amazing secondary rourke's a superstar i'm gonna keep trying this new playbook let's go Good run, Walker. I'm trying to be smart here. Talk about establishing themselves against the pass. You know, no fly zones and things of that nature. This group has Let's catch. Lock it. Good throw. I like that. Rourke just steps up. That's my favorite thing about Rourke. He just steps up in the pocket and throws absolute missiles. He's like 6'5", crazy throw power. The intangibles for Rourke are so here it's not even funny like he could be the best quarterback ever he has that potential good job dk let's go dk now back to throw ah good try rourke Thought. let's go man Good throw. That's a beam. That is an absolute beam in that situation. <sighs> oh my First 
throw it. Touchdown, Broncos. Shoot, that's bad defense. That's really bad defense. Out of the gun now on third down. Work in the middle of the field, and he's got a man. Okay, timeout. You got 43 seconds here. That's a pass he's got to have, and a pass he should have caught. Another. Again, he'll drop to throw. He's using his timeout. That's interesting, actually. I didn't expect him to use his timeout. Though it is smart, I didn't expect it. Because he is pretty much banking on me not being able to do anything right here. Which isn't bad, considering Taylor has a pretty decent defense. Get up and spike it. What's the time going to be? Yeah, just take it all the way. Just spike with like three. He's going to call a timeout. You're so weird. He's over here. Good job, New Orleans. Okay. He gets ball at half. We need to stop. Simple as that, we need to stop. And maybe open things up for a comeback here in this half. Yo, how is Penix faster than everybody? Good defense, third down. They're indeed going for it as they look to throw. Oh my gosh, dude, put a spy, Brett. Put a spy. The fourth down run plays are driving me insane. KO! Let's go! It's gotta be the longest drive I've ever seen in my life. It's not even anything. It's not even his fault. Like, he's not clocking me or anything. He's just throwing like ridiculously clutch third and fourth down conversions. He'll look to throw. He completes this to Sutton. They're gonna look to throw. Eluding the pressure right. And they'll bring him down. As expected, they're going for it to keep the drive alive. Good defense, guys. Longest drive I've ever seen in my life. Longest drive I think I've ever been a part of. Oh my gosh. Was that like 17 plays? There you go. Good run. I hate this game. He got it. Well done. Rourke. That wasn't good. Now they'll throw here out of the gun. Oh my gosh, I'm such a joke at this. Oh my gosh. After the pick six, they go right back. And he can't get a shoot. I'm not gonna pretend like we don't have a long way to go here. Gonna have to make some quick reads, kid. That's crazy. Good game. I choked. I choked this. Oh my god. I told you every single time. I win and then I lose. I win against him and then I lose it. Somehow I lose it. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm upset, but it is what it is. We gotta bounce back. Last leagues, I let one stupid decision in a really good year ruin my entire year and I made horrible decisions for the rest of the franchise. I don't want that to happen again. I want to avoid that at all costs. We're currently the number one seed still. We had a two game lead on the one seed going into that game. 
But now we just can't afford to lose. We got to be really, 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 really smart um, for the remainder of this one. Because I know how important it is. I don't want to get into a wild card and out situation like I've been in in the past. So Weatherspoon gets an upgrade. He's having a sneaky good year. A lot of our guys, we'll look through stats kind of after this game. This guy's been waiting for me though because I've been a little bit late. Um, but okay, week 15, let's go. Jacobs. Well, he's gonna get a... Here's Murray. Forced out to his left. One like, of you, oh, please. Shoot. One of you, please pick that. Shoot. After back to back incompletions, to throw is Murray. Calvin Joseph, that's a snuggie. That's a snuggie. Good defense. I got stuck. 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 Shoot. Out of the gun. Here's Murray. Murray gonna throw. Escaping the pressure right. Whoever that DB is has no hips. We got no hips, dude. No hips. This defense even. Oh, that's unlucky. That's a miss. Trying to figure out a big play here on third down to get their momentum going again. You know better. You gotta know better. You know better. Good job. Okay. Oh, we suck. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. And this pass broken up. Okay, relax. What is he in? Why can't you beat it? Go through the four steps of figuring stuff out. What is he in? Why can't you beat it? What's going on? That's insane. Okay, give the play a chance. Like, you don't have to be a, a rocket scientist, but, like, give the play a chance. Oof. Okay, it's happening. That thing, when I lose one game heartbreakingly and then I lose the rest of the games, it's happening again. Good defense. He's short again. He's short again. Excellent defense. His defense has been good enough to where I think 100% of the time you take three here. I haven't even moved yet, so that's the right call. Second and six. Dot. Relax, just make some simple reads. He is absolutely crazy in his pass rush right now. I don't know what's going on. Like his line is playing better than I've ever seen anything ever. Dot. How do you want to play this? Now to the ground, here's Walker. No, just score. Just score. Just score. Just score. Be great. Looking to throw. Got him. Touchdown, Seahawks. Half more than a minute. And we'll see if they just want to protect that lead or try to add on to it. Well, with as much time as is left on the <laughs> Here's Murray. Woolen. Stud. You just literally you can't throw at him. It's not even like it's not even a joke. If you don't have it, throw something up. Five, four. Got him. Oh, okay, that's fine. I'll take three. I'll take a tie game. We get ball at half. So our offense has sucked, but we get ball in seven points. It's a seven point lead. On first down, he'll drop to throw. Throw out wide to Walker. Out of the gun now. He's screaming at me, but I'm ready. I was ready for that. Okay, this carrot is never in there. Good throw. Okay, we need a dot or something because he's had me shook out here, man. But when in doubt. Tyler Lockett. Tyler Lockett! Sign him to a Supermax. 
I don't care. Use Fountain of Youth. I need Tyler Lockett back next year. 17-10. Dude hit a triple axle. At the 41 yard line. A gear for Walker running right. And he'll get the again it's Walker. It's the first. Now they'll switch it up here and look at no offense. How much do you want to risk? Oh, I'm still looking for somebody with some superhuman. Ah, gift. Just throw it out to Lockett. I haven't done that all game. He might not have even known that I did that. Just win the game, Lockett. Just win the game. Second and six. Dot. Okay, defense, we've been excellent all year. The only way he scored on that drive was a bomb against Calvin Joseph. The best defense in the league. Act like it, get a stop, and end this thing. Everybody wait. Say goodbye. Bye. Bye. Good game. Zoop. Zoop. GG's, man. <laughs> it's not all about winning. It's just about winning. Needed that game. 10 out of 10 needed that football game. 183 yards, three touchdowns for Rourke. <sighs> that is a victory you love to see. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, week number 16 going up against the Buffalo Bills. We are fighting. We're fighting for this number one seed right now. Um, every single game's a battle. And I'm trying, I think, I honestly think if I don't lose two games, the Vikings, I think they, yeah, they lost their game. So if I were to not lose another game, I would guarantee the number one seed. I I want to show this. I don't show this stat that much. I don't want to jinx anything. But I have the number one defense in the entire league. I think team stat-wise, I have the most interceptions in the entire league. And, like, we're kind of showing Legion kind of stuff. If you, if, if you really look at it, like, we're, we're kind of playing some good football right now. I don't know why. I went to, this is what team stats. Offense is bleh. But if we look at defense... Like, we're number one in every single category. It's not even close. And I'll still choke. I promise I will. But, no, I won't. It's a bad mindset. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, week 16 going up against the 4-10 and 10 Buffalo Bills. Um, this is a big one for Rourke. I want to make sure that, it, well, and it's not, like, important, important. But I also just want to make sure that Curtis can get good stats in games where we have opportunities to get good stats. He's a big quarterback. Like, honestly, frame-wise... 6'5", 231, that, that's legit. If we don't lose, probably keep the number one seed. If we, if we do, we could be in some trouble. They start the drive with Cook. This will be stuck. That's a feat to be proud of, especially with the emphasis oh, no. on offense. And what we're seeing each and every week. Cut in, cut in. The team, I don't think they have it. They might have a Super Bowl. Here's Allen. Got him. Best defense in the league, dude. Best defense I've ever had. Oh. <laughs> wow. Good hit, Devin. Yep, Tyler Lockett. Touchdown. Touchdown. Go Lockett. Good play. Lockett and Metcalf both have like... I definitely want to make sure Metcalf, he's close to a thousand yards. Um, and we started off this season a little bit rough with like just... We, we weren't playing good. So some of our stats are a little whack. Um, 
Nice, I not. nice catch, fan. I don't know what his user is doing right there, but I I appreciate it. I wouldn't be happy with it or sad is kind of what I'm trying to say. I just feel like I need to try and throw a dot here. And I do. It's exactly what we do. Okay. This, this, this blitz is getting there, but his user just went on vacation. His user is currently boarding in zone three for a flight to Cancun. That's how bad his user bit on the tight end play. Okay. 14-7, we get ball at half. We should be okay. Got him. Boy, a Mafe! Got him. Angles wise, if I can get 31 Returnable for out of play. Oh, I thought we'll I could. They're gonna look to throw. This one goes underneath to Walker. That's the best play I've ever seen. That's the best individual effort from a football player I think I've ever seen. How on earth did he just do that? How is that a first down? Rourke. Rourke is so good, but just misses so many throws. He misses every throw, but he's so good. At the same time, he's my favorite quarterback ever, but his accuracy is not good. You can't win them all. He's like on the run, dude's insane. Heads up, heads up, time out. I don't think he's great in these situations, no. Got him. Fant, 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 Fant. DK's gonna catch that though, that's the one thing I know. That's the one thing, I red zone threat DK. You can hit stick him, you can do whatever, he's still gonna catch it. 21-7. Okay. 10 out of 10 first half. That's a dot. That did you see how that that was thrown badly? That was thrown badly, but resulted in an absolutely perfect situation, even though that was a bad ball. That's a legit bad ball. I too, too much. Dot. Bro, there's a time and a place. There's a time and a place to rocket catch. That, like, to rat catch. That was the time and the place. There we go. That's what, ah, oh, I need to learn how to use KOs better. I don't love that read. Some reads I really like, that one I don't. I, nothing about that read is good. Just don't, yep, yeah, there was a KO there. Kept it away from it, good throw. That's crazy. Look at Lockett is just routing everybody up. Lockett, like, one-on-one -on -one in man coverage, he's my favorite. By far, he's my favorite. That's not good. That's a universal. And while it won't likely cost them in this game, they're going to regret the fact that they caught one up here. Yeah, their first blemish. They had mistake free. Relation sense. So the shotgun snap to Allen. He's going to let it go again. Got a man. It's caught inside the 10. And 
the Seahawks. Looks like they've recovered. They have. They'll set up to throw. Slide. Make sure. There we go. I had to make sure I slid for that one. On third down, he'll drop to throw. And he's going to be. They're going to look to throw. He's got his target. There you go, DK. Football successfully. Pass taken in by his big tight end. And the Seahawks are going to be able to resist on first and goal. GG's, dude. GG's. Excellent performance. Honestly, this matters. Like, in games where you should win, we need to be throwing the ball. We need to be putting up stats. Um, not only just for the one seed, but just because Rourke is actually putting together a quietly sort of really good season. 39 touchdowns, 7 picks. Not a lot of yards, but a decent year worthy of at least, like, being talked about. Um, the issue is the like rookies of the year you can see in the AFC it's Drake May but in the NFC we're not far behind Bo Nix this Raiders game's important if we win I believe we have a force win against the 49ers if we win this next game we guarantee the number one seed okay ladies and gentlemen the good news is the Giants play against the Vikings um, that's the good news that's the really, really, really good news. Because the Giants can beat him. I don't know who is the Giants. I'm not 100% sure who the Giants is, but the Giants do play against, I think the Giants is a relatively good player, but that's neither here nor there. Okay, we just need a win. We got no breakouts, we got nothing. We simply just need a win. They'll come out throwing here on first down. Oh my. That's a duck. That's a duck. That is an absolute duck. Picked off by Jamal Adams. And the Seahawks. Back to throw here. Throw out wide to Walker. Good job. Okay, we got to stop first drive. We got an easy, easy, easy stop first drive. So honestly, he beat us the first time. He played really well that first time. I just want to. Take the clock down a little bit. Be smart. We're playing for the number one seed right now. So you cannot take a game lightly when you're playing for the number one seed. On third and short, they'll try and pick it up through the air. Not. Those plays. Try and go to those spots and get your offense moving. Now this throw They'll look to throw now on first down. Throw again. Got him. Baron! Revenge is a dish. Best served revenge, baby. Dot. Such a good throw, Rourke. That's such a good throw. Hmm. The defense isn't bad. They're gonna try and throw. What the heck? Oh my gosh! Dare I say a horrible drive? I hated everything about that. I need to just run the ball. I think if I run the ball, I win this game. Try to shake off the interception. He'll look to throw. That's crazy. Good throw. There was still more than a minute to go in the half. Time to try to mount the run. And I would think that they would have it. But I think he's going to go. They're not going to get him. Do we want to sit or score? Score. Score and put the pressure on. Score and put the pressure on. They need him right now because they're trailing. Yeah, this is exactly why you practice a two-minute drill. Now a shotgun snap as they'll look to throw. Nowhere to go here. He lost the ball. Oh. Do you, he calls a timeout. Looking to throw. Gonna be 
taken in here by now back to throw he's gonna float this one deep right side did I what happened what happened to my DBs I must have shaded down okay he's got pretty good thing going on right now you're so good DK Time out. Again, he'll drop to throw. Oof, that was a bust. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. And Back to throw. To the end zone, but it's incomplete. Are they okay? I guess he did drop that. Dang, I thought that was a catch. Shoot. Charles, for them, pretty good first half on the ground. They had some success running the ball in quarters one and two, and they got the lead. Now a chance. Again, it's Walker. And he'll get it coming from. You don't have to worry about the backside at all. That allows you to run with a little bit more confidence as you traverse down the field. Okay, just run. His run defense looks horrible. So if we can take a 10 point lead running. We're sweating, and this is definitely someone who we don't want to see in the playoffs, but we're playing some pretty good football right now. I'm going to go, DK. Dot! Dot! Shoot. I got a penalty though. I ran into him. I think he knew that. That's why he just threw an absolute book. But okay, I just I don't want it. the reason why I've been so locked in this game is I don't want to choke another one seed. I'm just I'm really sick of doing that. It's become a bit of a thing on the channel that we just lose. So underneath caught by the tight end Allen. They'll drop to throw. Williams brings it in. Out of the gun. They'll look to throw. Oh my gosh. Okay, he's gonna onside. They'll try and throw for it. Flush to his right. Oh my gosh. DK never change. Oh my gosh, we could have just lost the game. Oh, he's out of bounds. It's the worst thing I could have done. I got stuck in that animation. Second and fourteen. That's crazy. They'll set up a throw. Completes it to fail on the right side. It's up to me. What do I want to do? I feel like I know what to do. I just don't know if I'm gonna do what I need to do. You know what I mean? I know what I should do, but I don't want to do what I should do. If that makes any sense to you guys. Dot. GG's. I know what to do. I don't want to do what I have to do. That should be GG's. That was aggressive, but that's... Hey. That's somebody who wants the one seed. Let me tell you right now. That is somebody who wants the one seed. It's about time. We're back. We deserve it with this season. This was an unbelievable season. We deserve the number one seed. With that all being said, we got a force win week 18. Guys, we have officially clinched the number one seed on another great game from Rourke. Unreal game from Walker. Okay, guys, we did it. Guys, playoff schedule, you don't see us the first round because we did it. Number one seed. Now, this is a blessing and a curse. Now, we, we can talk about things here for a little bit. Um, let's talk about Rourke real quick. Did he win an award? Pro Bowl. He made a Pro Bowl. That was XP. I don't know what the XP that he's... He, he gets two upgrades, essentially. Let's go look through the awards. Let's look at his season stats. Um, because we got some decisions to make going into next year. 
43 touchdowns to nine picks, was horrible at times. Like just to put it clear, Rourke had a mid-season turnaround where we just went crazy. But other than that, we weren't great. But 43 touchdowns and nine picks was very good. Kenneth gets almost a thousand yards. Our offense didn't, nobody was insane. It was all defense. That was the story. Woolen got six, Barron got eight. I think both those guys could get superstar in the offseason. Nate Wiggins had a good rookie year. Good seasons from Nuosu and Boyamafe. Um, all this being said, like, I'm proud of the team. I feel like that was an impressive year, but at the end of the day, we got to win. And it's it's hard to know if I can win with Rourke, but I, I do believe that I can. Barron almost wins defensive player of the year, but I don't know who we're gonna be playing. We're about to find out. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, boom, fellas. Divisional playoff three games. All we got to do today is win three games and we are in the Super Bowl. It's simple, it's elegant, it's all it needs to be. Um, this is the type of game that I absolutely hate. It's a player that I beat handedly the first time, 24 to three. Never a person you wanna see in the playoffs because if you beat someone 24 to three, they hate you. And clearly he's a good player because he made it this far. I embarrassed him. There was a lot of trash talk going on. This guy wants nothing more than to see my video end with him laughing and me crying. There's nothing that he would love more than that. So we gotta do everything in our power to prevent that. We gotta lock in, we gotta try and find a way to win. Boy Amafe gets an upgrade as well. He's gonna get plus one on speed rusher. Not here to just hang out. I, I, I wanna be a champion. I wanna figure this thing out. And I, I believe in this team. Let's go look at this squad that we're playing here. Um, the first time we played, I would say I caught him off guard but he's a better team than he was now. He's got Amari Cooper, Amonor St. Brown, Jamison Williams, Sam Laporta, um, Chop Robinson, Kendall Fuller. His defense isn't very good, but his receivers are low key kind of crazy. So I would say my jumping and play rec is all pretty good. I kind of feel like it needs to go towards this. This is throw power. Why don't I do this? So, Awareness, deep accuracy, you know what? We're gonna spend a lot. His deep accuracy is terrible. Throw under pressure, yes. Throw power, I think I can only up by one. Catching for wide receivers and tight ends. That, that's a good one as well. Okay, guys, we're three games away. Let's lock in like Stockton. Let's play good, let's have fun, and let's be a winner. Let's go. This team that he has is significantly better than the last time we played. Like by a long shot better. Shoot. Shoot. Okay. Tough start, everybody. Shoot. Okay, we got to. Um, he dotted us up. He absolutely dotted us up. Good job, DK. Good fight. Want to make sure he can stop the run. Before we do too much with Rourke, before we ask too much of Rourke, I want to make sure that we know how to stop the run, that we can find ways to creatively or non-creatively get off the field or to stay on the field is kind of what I'm saying because you don't want to get into just like a boom, 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 have to throw every single play type deal. Um, and I have a really good running back. So Kenneth could be gone here, honestly. Good job, Walker. Good run, sir. That's 15. Tyler Lockett, go Tyler, well done sir. Beautiful play by Tyler Lockett. To juke, to get the first down, I believe in our defense. I know that first drive, our defense was a train wreck, but I do believe that our defense is going to find a way to get stops out here. Uh. 
Alright. They'll drop to throw. Ah. I think you do. As much as I hate doing it, good defense by him. As much as I absolutely hate doing it, I do think in this spot you got to trust the defense. It's been good all year. It's been the best defense in the league by far this entire season. Oh, gosh. Good defense. Good user by him. On the two plays that I did, he, he did excellent. He really, really, really did excellent. Good defense, guys. A shotgun snap for goal. Excellent. On fourth down, goal. Got him. Okay, give me the ball back. Walker now on first and ten. This will be a short. Here's a second and seven. I love that read I just made whatsoever. I definitely didn't love it. I love that read, though. Way to be, Rourke. We get ball at half. That's why we trusted our defense. I didn't want to give him full momentum. I wanted to make sure that I gave my defense a chance to come out, get a second chance against him to get a stop. And that's exactly, precisely what we did. Okay, 10-7. Okay, it looks like he's going to try and switch up his strategy and run the ball a little bit against us, which I respect. I respect because it just worked excellent back-to-back -back plays. Good play by him. Oh gosh, we do get ball at half. Our offense isn't necessarily built to score in like two plays though. That's the thing. But we have 124. If we can get points here, if we can get points after half, we can take control of this entire game. It's just not necessarily what we do best. Um, and his his running offense has been stellar. Back to throw now on second and ten. Is he out? to stay in bounds and complete the catch. And a great job by our crew on the camera shot. Love when you see the grass or the field. Um, three helps. It's just not ideal. I'd love to try and attack for seven here. I really, really, really would. Whether or not it's going to be there, if there's going to be opportunity, I don't know. But I would love nothing more than seven points here. I know it would help us out. A ton. Rourke, that's a beauty. That is a beauty from Rourke. Out to the right, he gets it to lock it. And down and down. That is caught at the seventh. Walker. I love you, Kenneth Walker. I love you, Kenneth Walker. Never forget that, please. I love you, dude. That was so clutch. Oh, that juke move was freaking amazing. This drive is important. I'm not gonna pretend this is not. This is incredibly important. Good job, Walker. Well done, kid. I think I got him. I think I got DK. Better have them, yes sir. What? Who? How? Oh my gosh. There's no chance that that just happened. You have no idea how crucial that was. I'm sure. Do you trust your defense? I think you got to. Even if he gets seven, a three gets us back. How he caught Walker, I have no sweet clue. That was a touchdown. Oh my gosh. 
was at halftime following the field goal a moment ago. Oh my gosh, that's not a good read though. The end zone. To throw is gone. That is caught. To throw on second down is gone. Okay. Incomplete old school. Right around 50%. Yeah, he's under 50%. He needs to start hitting more targets. And they'll get him down. Back to Montgomery on second down. And this defense. Again, they'll go ground with Montgomery. All right, second and five. Now gone. Dancing to his left. And he's in game. You should be above 60% just to be in the average range. They'll set up the screen to Montgomery. He's short. They go ahead and snap it. Gone. Did he, he got it? Territory as they need a touchdown and a PAT for the look. And he's going to take it in for a line. Dang, good drive. That fourth down, dude. That fourth down, he made a super good play. Shout out to him. Okay, we're going to get an onside, which means he's trying to make sure that I... He's going to probably give me the lead, assuming I get the onside. Thank you. Thank you, Jack. Thank you, Jack. Recover the ball, which is what we saw here. I just wonder if that number is much more of a anecdotal type of a number. Second and six. Oh, he missed him. He missed him. Shoot, he missed him. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Just by a tiny bit, too. That's the thing. Like, that wasn't a big miss. That was barely. I barely missed him. Dang. That's a crazy, crazy play. Dang, good play by Gardner Johnson. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, he got us. Still hope. Still hope, defense. Still hope. Got to stop this run game. That number one thing is we got to find a way to stop this run game. And he breaks he breaks the tackle and gets it. Five points of contact necessary at this stage is there. Goff now to throw. This is Montgomery with a grab over the middle. It's worst case scenario. Good game. That was a good performance. It's just not enough in the playoffs. We beat this guy 24 to 3 in the regular season. We got a real playoff issue right now. Like a, we got a legitimate playoff issue at the moment. Oh gosh. I don't know how to get out of it. Shoot. I promised I did my best. I'm mad about the freaking Kenneth Walker run, but I'm in a playoff slump. We're not, I, I feel like our team's going to get a lot better in this offseason. Um, we're still relatively young. We got a young QB. I feel like we did pretty good. That, that pick from Gardner Johnson was unbelievable. That was really, really, really good. Let me see. Who did I have here? Who did I have? Yeah, he cross-manned Gardner Johnson on that guy. So I, I throw it here, and Gardner Johnson just makes an insane CPU pick. Those those are game ceiling plays. The pressure was coming too. Even though we lost, I still had a lot of fun, and I, I still believe in this team. I still believe in the future, um, and we're gonna we're gonna get things figured out. We're gonna get out of our heads. We're gonna get out of this playoff losing streak, and we're gonna start winning some bowls. But as of right now, you guys gotta stick with me through these tough times because I'm selling like crazy.